So, uh, uh, my name is Yutaro, Yutaro Sensei. You can just call me by my name. Okay, there's a combination of many classes now. I think Wakabayashi Sensei, my father's class, and Kurihara Sensei. I don't know, maybe also inside. Okay, uh, but it's split into two, uh, which means uh, some are taking the Saturday one instead, so it's not too crowded. Okay, yeah, there'll be time for you to bring to breakout rooms as you see from the links, right? That's where you're gonna go to discuss later, okay, uh, in smaller groups. Okay, so uh, you, you can join late, not to worry, because uh, it, it's recorded anyway. Okay, so the class, right, tentatively so far has been 7 p.m., okay? All right, another person keep it joining. Okay, and um, yeah, it, you can choose either Wednesday or Saturday, or you can come for both, uh, but we're teaching the same thing. Okay, and textbook lesson three. So for my current class, right, that's uh, always taking the Wednesday one, right? Yeah, there's some mixed up because you see, got tr lesson three, lesson three B, correct? Okay, uh, if you see my recordings from in YouTube, right, all uh, every lesson is one textbook lesson. Yeah, so so because the slides was prepared like this, and because my Jurong classes all are three hours. Yeah, so so uh, it will be slightly longer now, two and a half plus minus. Okay, so it, yeah, I will try not to drag too long as well. Huh? It will be good if you memorize your vocabulary beforehand. Okay, everyone should have your textbook. Uh, those who don't have uh, can PM me. Uh. Uh, we are using the white textbook. Uh. Some of you are using the blue one more, right? Okay, uh, it's about the same. Okay, the difference is only uh, the white one, lesson four is our blue one, lesson adjectives, lesson eight. Uh. I used the book two, three years ago, uh, but we since changed the white book. But some teachers are more comfortable with the old book. Okay, those with the blue book, anyone here with the blue book, can you tell me in the chat? Okay, uh, you can reply by the chat box or you can reply by unmuting and just talk to me in the chat. You have both, right? I think some, yeah, a bit waste, but never mind. Okay, it's about the same thing. Okay, uh, yeah, as you can see, the blue book, uh, it's, we have been using that for almost 40 years, I guess. You, you can tell, right? Yeah, since since the start of the school, for, for almost 40 years ago. Okay, uh, yeah, actually it should be lesson eight, if I remember correctly. Then lesson five, right, will be lesson nine, but not to worry. Yeah, I will inform your teachers like, what I have taught. Then when you go back to your physical classes, uh, the teacher know what to teach for the remaining of the class. Okay? It doesn't matter which order comes first because uh, there's no prerequisite for like lesson four adjectives. You'll learn it on its own. You don't need lesson one to lesson three knowledge. Okay. But today we are going through lesson three, textbook lesson three, all should be the same. Okay, talking about places. You all have both, right? Yeah. I think that's my desk class. Okay, uh, okay, very good. Then uh, recorded, uploaded, I will send, I think most of you have the link to rewatch reading. Okay, so if you really have to miss both, uh, if you miss both lessons, it's okay. There will be, you can go back and rewatch. Uh, it's uh, almost the same thing. Okay, but it's prefer that you all join the class because there will be time where you all be talking to each other. Okay, any questions, you all can just ask uh, on the chat or just unmute to ask. Uh. Okay, there will be participation also. That means you need to read, just like in your classes or in your classrooms. I uh, need to read, you need to answer questions, okay? There'll be people who's not convenient to answer, you can type out, okay? Uh, maybe not convenient to answer, or your mic has problem, and or you're shy, la, it's fine, okay? Right, any issues? Uh, if you don't reply uh, in a few seconds, uh, I mean five, ten seconds, right? I assume you're, you're not able to use your mic or something, okay? It's okay, sometimes I'll just skip you. So if you want me to skip you, just type skip or something, just let me know, it's fine. Yeah, okay, whatever reasons you have, it's okay. Yeah, so it's optional. Let's see you are. Mm, okay, next slide. Okay, so this is something new. Uh. Let me highlight the things that uh, you all need to take note of. Okay, I'm sure I told some of the groups already. I think we have at least seven groups for this, this lesson. Uh. Yeah, but, but everyone is split out. Okay, so we are currently in this, uh, this is a timetable. Uh. Wednesday, uh, so you'll be, you know, a uh, CGG. Okay, so uh, you are supposed to attend the class the usual class would be this, okay? For the the whole of June, uh, plus minus, uh, if there's any changes, I'll let you know, but it should be like that, okay? If there's public holiday, there will be changes, but yeah, I, don't, I don't remember having, okay? So it's either you join, you will join the Wednesday one or the Saturday, yeah. Okay, those in the group chats, you all should know, right? Either or, or you can even join both if you want to have extra revision, although I'll be talking about the same thing, okay? Yeah, this will be the standard, your usual time, your usual timing, uh, Okay, and because it's online and a lot of classes are joining in, uh, so uh, you have the option to join every other classes. Okay, what I mean, okay, what I mean by that? Uh, basically, the link won't change. Uh, so you all know how it works, right? The link I sent you all is the shared document, which everyone 
will go to the link except when you go to the file right the classrooms link will be changed yeah but you all can see the changes uh, so it won't be issue you know someone joining uh someone joining another room wait now uh, give me a minute check the one thing see Xavier uh sorry Xavier you joined the wrong room can you join the main room it's at the, the link is at the top yeah so yeah you join the the, the... Oh, this is under my breakup uh, um, um breakout is for later yeah, you can. Oh, so where's the link? Uh? So uh, it's in the same file, uh, but you need to scroll to the top, the highest. Um, so how do I do this? Uh, you can hang up, uh. You can hang up, or you can you can oh, stay. Okay. Yeah, you can at stay the top, okay. at the top. Yeah, you, you try. Yeah. Okay, so uh, as you can see, some of you all joined the breakout rooms just now, right? Uh, it's for later. That's where we split up. I think I need to open three or four rooms already later. Yeah. Uh, so we have twenty-seven people around here. Not. Not the most. Uh. my my e two my e two in on Saturday on Sunday is uh. 30 over students, yeah. Partly because I think about three classes, or three full classes. Okay, so um, see whether you can join. Up. Okay, it's here. Okay, it's even some here. All right. Um, from here, okay. Uh, the usual classes for this time slot would be either Wednesday or Saturday. It's actually for my new class that they started as an online class. Some of you are when you started, it was physical class, right? Until it starts to yeah, it's the circuit breaker started right? okay so you have the option to join every other classes so let me change to pen first huh? okay you can want to revise your lesson one okay that means back to first lesson some of you all have stopped for a few months right how long have you all stopped huh? some of the first timers here first time i'm teaching you on okay i don't know you all stopped for two three months right okay, if you forget everything already just go ahead and just join me on friday for lesson one okay or uh, Saturday 4 p.m. Okay, these, these two are new classes for. Yeah, I tried to do some books. Okay, so so actually, if you forget everything, already just cut from lesson one again. So you can attend both. Lah, okay, you can attend everything. So it's like a buffet. Yeah. So please, please feel free to join because online is okay. And because my new classes here on Friday 7 and 4 p.m. Saturday, right, there are about only 10 students. And if they split up, only 5 5. So if you want to come for extra revision, please go back. Okay, and some of you want to miss some lessons, you want to just go ahead. Just a 10, okay? Then, um, okay, I will send you this slide. Uh. If I forget to send you this slide, maybe you want to take a photo now, it's also okay. In fact, it's actually in the, the, the Word document that you use to join the class. You scroll to the bottom, there is this, okay? Yeah. So, uh, some ad advice is, uh, because some of you all will be joining my, my, I think, lesson, okay, where is it? Uh? Yeah, le lesson lesson nine. Uh. Some of you are already at lesson nine really, at 10 a.m. Right. So you you coming for your usual class here and you are here also for extra revision is fine. Right. So it's up to you all to join. Okay. Uh yeah. Next week, revision is the last lesson, lesson 10 after lesson 10. All right. So not applicable for most of you. Right. There's also lesson, yeah. So here are the lessons like, that you all can consider joining extra. Okay. Textbook lesson two. So if you follow this right every week. Today we do lesson three, next week, lesson four, lesson five, lesson six, lesson seven. Okay, then hopefully in July you can go back to your class and your teacher will teach you lesson eight mm -hmm. and continue. Okay, any questions? Again, it's for you to join. Yeah, all these are feel free to join. Uh. The link is always there. Okay, you can just uh, access the link and just uh, attend. Yeah, uh, there won't be attendance taking or what. Uh. So you can just join. Yeah, this is lesson one. It should be lesson four. Uh. Okay, so this month you can actually finish a whole syllabus really. Yeah, any, any questions feel free to ask. May I can see you uh can you all can uh can yeah, just... you go down? I have questions. Let me share the recording. I have questions. Yeah, question please ask. No no no, it's my son. Okay. <laughs> okay, no worries. No problem. Okay, so this is the whole Ju uh, June. Uh. Okay, hopefully we don't need to go into we don't need to go into July because uh yeah, it's not very troublesome. Okay. Right, so let me go to the next slide already. Okay, so actually for my this class, right, we have lesson two homework. Okay, those who don't know, do you not expect any homework, right? I'm sure you can do on the spot. Okay, so everyone will need to tell me your answers, okay? So as usual, let me have the class list. Okay, look at the right side. Uh, there's a people list, uh, 29 plus minus, minus two of me, 27. Uh. Okay, we were going to take turns to read your answers. Okay, those who have not tried this, it's okay. You can run a piece of paper. Maybe some of you have did it already. Okay, if you did it already, then you can tell me verbally, Sherry. Okay, I'm sure you can translate Sherry. Let me have the first person, Elvin. Elvin Tan. Korewa Tokei Des. Okay, Korewa Tokei Des. Very good. Okay, should I write out or yeah? Okay, course lesson three. Uh, I'm still writing Romaji. 
right? Remember, soon after you all need to all write hiragana already, okay? Right, Niban, let me go to Brian, Brian san, and Kaden san. Okay, uh, prepare your answers. Uh, I'm going by the class list on the right side. Okay, if you cannot speak as usual, you can just type out your answer. Okay, we're going through this very quickly. Okay, if you want me to skip, also let me know skip, then I, I know what to do. Uh, skip, please. Skip, uh, okay, and Brian skip, then I go to. Oh no, everyone only go up already. Okay, Kaden, Kaden san, I think you can do right. Uh, sorry, well, hon dewa arimasen. Mm, very good. Sorry, hon dewa arimasen. Very good. Say kai there. So, okay, correct. Huh? So, what happened is uh, we learned in E2, right? This lesson 2, I mean, okay, because this is homework 2.1. Huh? This and that, kore, sore, are. Okay, this is that, right? Is it sore or are? Okay, on paper, we don't know. We don't know how far the book is. So, it doesn't matter. Sore, are, both are correct. Okay. And of course, there were arimasen. You need to know from lesson one, right? Okay, there's and there were arimasen. Very good. Okay, any different answer, you feel feel free to type out. Huh? Then we your sometimes I will miss the chat box, but you your friends will help you help me to answer also, huh? not to worry. Okay, number three, someone Coco Coco San. Okay. Coco San. Okay, so if possible, you can try to just unmute and tell me an answer quietly. Okay, when do you use there were? Very good question. Okay, while well, Coco is preparing, uh, let me. Uh, there were Adema Sen, it's just it's not. I'm gonna check in June in camp, so I'm not sure. Okay, uh, yeah, those who cannot make it, you try to make it. If cannot, it's okay. Can we make it for the test? Uh, hello. Yeah, can I hear you. Korewa okay, very good. Okay, uh, again, Korewa, Sorewa doesn't matter. Korewa nan deska, correct. Okay, Korewa nan deska, so uh, because they said that, what is this? Uh? So, correct. Circle, uh, this, correct. Okay, very good. Yeah, so I can okay the, for the test, right? Your test will be usually the last lesson of the course, elementary one. And usually after the test, you finish your test, you can make a move already. Uh and our test currently is all online. So it will be a Google form. I will send you a link, you can do any time. Okay, that is towards the end of the course. Huh? Okay, some of you are from the towards the end of the course already. Yeah, but okay, so so there's no deadline for your test or anything. Yeah, no, not to worry. Okay, Hello. Yeah, I may pronounce strongly, uh, but uh, Ilo, right? Ilo, son? Hey, number, Yongbat, number four. Sorry, is that me? Yeah, it's, it's you. Can I pronounce correctly? Oh, uh, yes. Okay, Ilo, uh, yes. Okay. Uh, sorry, wa. Very good. Okay. Sorry, wa. Anata wa kaban desu ka? Okay, uh, wait, uh, it's number four, but okay, you read number five, already, very good. Sore wa? Yeah. Sore wa. Yeah. Sorry, I forgot what's box. Box, ah, okay, it's okay. Mm -hmm. anyway. Okay, well, uh, let me ask the rest, what do you all think one box? Hako desu. Okay, hako desu, very good. Okay, yeah. Very good. Okay, so when I usually we want we take turns like, Okay, if you don't know, then I ask your friend so everyone can think about it also. Okay, now which book to take out? To be honest, you don't need your textbook. Huh? Oh, this is your homework actually. Homework from two point one. Those not my class one. I don't know you all received the same same homework or different homework. But uh, don't worry, because uh, you should be able to translate on the spot. Okay, but maybe after two three months you'll forget everything lah. Okay, we will revise together. So you don't need your book right now. Okay, don't need your book right now. It's a shukudai desu homework. It's hakodes. Okay, why they bracket it is because Japanese don't eat. Okay, we just say this or that again. Okay, I bracket means it's optional. Your answer just hakodes is correct already. Okay, okay. All right? Because uh, like I said, uh, if I ask you what is this, you say uh, this is a box or it is a box, right? But for Japanese and Chinese, we don't have the this. This is more. Uh, this is You don't have the it equivalent for Chinese also. Okay, right? So you can just omit it entirely. Yeah. Okay, number go ban number five. Let me have uh, Ian. Yeah, the, number, the name all change. Ian, Ian, sir. Go ban, right? Yeah, go ban. Anatano, anatano carbon, the carbon desu ka? Very good. Okay, anatano carbon desu ka? Anatano carbon desu ka? Okay, yes. So they were uh, optional. Okay, of course. Uh, because in real life you are pointing at the thing. Is that your bag? Okay, or just your bag, okay, anata no kaban desu ka? All right, so that's what I mean by read your vocab beforehand. So you need to know what is box, what is bag, what is watch, what is book, okay? Magazine, newspaper, everything uh, will be helpful. Hey, uh, Tsugiwa, Irina, Irina-san? 
。はい、これは私のカバンです。うん、はい。これは、それは、ギターズメトコスアイウスドのハファイソベック。これは、私のカバンです。Okay, those who have not tried, you want to try, you can, yeah, after the class, you can refer back to the slides and try to do on the spot. This also can then before checking the answers again, okay? Yeah, uh, uh, can I ask, like, how do we see who is next? In the oh, order? Oh, okay, do you see a people list on the right side? Uh, if you see in the screen, do you see a 29 people on top? Did they put a, oh, yeah, 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 so that's the uh, alphabetical order, yeah. Oh, okay, okay. So yeah, so okay, I'm also okay, trying to okay. yeah, don't touch myself. Okay, not mm -hmm. to worry, because I also try to list out all the people name while you are talking. Huh? So Jesel, Jesel, son, another man, number seven. After Jenny, huh? Jenny, son, and yeah, Jaron. But worry, I write out then suddenly someone skip. Hey, why are you reading? Then Jesel. Hey, sorry, I didn't unmute myself. Sorry. Oh, yeah, what does she know? Uh, Dewa Arima san. うん、いいえ、私のではありません。Okay, forgive my handwriting.、Uh, anyway, any other answer, please、uh, feel free to type in the chat. Okay, we can discuss.、Uh, also, I think somebody mentioned why is ではありません。Is it? I saw just not something. Oh, when do you use ではではは is,、uh, is um, this, basically this holding ではありません means uh, uh, it's not, I'm not, are not, okay, or 不是啊。So this is not a book. I'm not a teacher. You're not a Japanese. The, it's not and not. Okay. But there was itself got meaning also. Okay. What does she know? Carbon there was not correct. There was also full marks answer. Okay. So the carbon. Let me put in first. Ah,、uh, it's optional. Optional means have or don't have. It's still full marks. Okay. Can any question? Uh, can I ask? So what would be the positive way to say like that is my book? Like there won't be the there was right? Ah, there won't be there was. This is the positive. Ah, there was Arima Sen is the negative. So just be sorry、so、on this. Yeah, correct. Yeah, depends on the what you want to say. So yes, it's a book, right? So hi, so there was on this. Yeah. Oh, okay. 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 So the、uh, positive and negative is here, lah. Top and bottom. Question set six and seven. Okay. So uh, can I say Kore wa watashi no there was Arima Sen? Yeah, can. Okay, so I write down again. Ah,、uh, kore sore is optional because they also bracket it out for you. Okay, it's a bit squeezy. I'm so sorry. Usually, write whiteboard lah,、uh, more space. Yeah. Okay. So there's a lot of combination. Okay, I bracket these two things, right? Kore wa and kaban means you can omit either one. Okay, you can omit two. You can put two inside. Okay, so from this combination, got four answers. Right? Ie watashi no dewa arimasen. Ie watashi no kaban dewa arimasen. Ie kore wa watashi no dewa arimasen. Ie kore wa watashi no kaban dewa arimasen. Okay. Yeah, you get the point. Okay. Minimum is watashi no dewa arimasen. The one that is not bracketed. This whole thing. Okay. And so yeah. Okay, feel free to ask ah、uh, because ah、uh, I I don't think I can can able to mark everyone's answer. Yeah. So it's, but of course you can just WhatsApp me again lah.、Uh, I got time. I will just take a look. Okay. If not. Usually my average class size is about fifteen,、uh, or ten to fifteen. Yeah, but if thirty people submit to me, I'm gonna have a hard time marking. But I will still try. Don't worry. Okay. Uh, Jin, Jin San, Jinny, is it or Jin? Yeah, Jinny. Jinny, Jin. Uh, これは誰の実証ですか Very good. これは誰の実証ですか Correct. Okay. Any other? Answers, okay. They break out it, ah.、Huh? They just、uh, want you to take out this, ah.、Huh? Doesn't really matter, okay. Either is either way is full. Dare no jisho desu ka, okay. Straight or zutia, full dictionary. Very good. Hi, Sugi wa, ah, Jiren, Jiren san. Hi, ah, the answer is ah, sensei no des. Hmm, sensei no des. Okay, here comes the kanji already. So, uh, ah,、oh, very good. Somebody mentioned another answer, ah. Kono jisho wa dare no desu ka, ah, no difference. Okay, we did that lesson last week, right? Okay, sorry, those who are not in my class,、uh, you can rewatch the previous lesson, right? Kore and kono difference is just a、uh, remember. This is my umbrella, and this umbrella is mine. Yeah, both works also. Okay, we'll still give you full marks for the. Yeah. Okay, if you use kono means the, the English change slightly. Ah,、uh, whose dictionary is this become? Ah,、uh, this dictionary is whose. You see what I mean? Okay, it's just a different way of saying the same thing. Yeah, it works also. 
Okay, so uh, those uh, my my now is the N5 kanji. Uh. So what is going on? Those not from my class. I always like to mention JLPT N5 kanji consists of 103 kanji that you need to learn first before you can learn the next thousand. Okay, N5 is the lowest level. Uh. Include your all this. Okay, numbers we went through the past three weeks already. Okay, so some of you I know it's been a few months, uh, but you are supposed to read all these kanji as each in san yong go. Okay, I'm not sure you all know. Some teachers, Nakai Sensei especially, he don't teach the kanji in E1 first because uh, it may scare off some people. Okay, but me and my dad, we would like to show some kanji because we don't want you to show, we don't want to show you 100 in E2 all of a sudden. Uh. That will also scare some people away. So I only show you the first few, uh, first 100. Okay, so Sensei is one of the N5 kanji. Okay, uh, and yeah, JLPT don't need to worry about the, uh, you'll get the list, uh, usually in elementary too. Okay, Sensei. No, that's okay. Some of you I know you all have written in hiragana, that's very good. Okay, like I told you before, it's usually half the course, then you must master your hiragana. That means you need to know how to recognize all these characters. Okay, yeah, sensei looks like this one. Huh? Okay, and the kanji is N5. So some of you comfortable with kanji, you can write already. Okay, all are full marks. Okay, you can you can write, sorry, very messy, uh, but no choice. You can write like this, full marks, you can write like this, okay, you can write like this, all are full marks answer. Okay, for your E1 test. Yeah, minimum Romaji. I think everyone can write ABC, no? so no issue. Okay, can you all get to my style very soon? Uh? I guess every teacher, all the style is different. Uh? So, yeah, so, so sorry, I have to get used to it. Okay, number 10, Juban. Right, so let me have uh, Jia Ling, Jia Ling San. Okay, don't worry if you make a mistake. Yeah. You can yeah, just try okay, if you are. Uh... Okay, after that, John Sting. Okay, while waiting, we can. Yeah, so that's it. Just this and then Joel. Okay. So, Jia Ling, are you there? Jia Ling, son. Yeah, I skip to I skip Jia Ling first. Huh? I go to Justin. Justin, can you try number eleven? Jiu Jiu Man. Okay, usually I wait a few seconds if not responding then I guess maybe not so convenient it's okay okay uh, maybe Joel Joel -san, I go to number 12 Anata wa nansai desu ka? okay very good okay Anata wa nansai desu ka? okay we thought this homework is really to revise what we learned last week huh? because if you don't touch we already forget any other answer any other answer okay, some of the students may know yeah let me see uh. Yeah, oikutsu. Okay, so there's two options of asking age on nansai desu ka or oikutsu desu ka. Okay, both are the same. Okay, both are the same. You can think of that also. Yeah, anata wa oikutsu desu ka? Also can. Okay, very good. Uh, Johnny, Johnny san, Jiu san man. Okay, Johnny san there. Okay, I see a chat there or something. Let me know. Uh, could, um, okay, I will skip. Johnny, I'll first skip. Keep coming. Keep coming. Keep coming. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Number 13. Uh, uh, 14. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, Kanajo wa Hitachi desu. Mm, very good. Hitachi. Kanon, correct. Kanajo wa Hitachi desu. Okay, why 20 years old? It's a special age, right? <laughs> Correct, it's a special age. Correct. Okay, so if you have the age list, I hope you all remember. Okay, anyone do have the age list, let me know. Maybe other class will have. Okay, yeah, 20 years old, very special because Japanese age of coming. They become an adult. Okay, we rarely say ni ju sai, although they can understand. But hatachi is the answer. Okay, so let me fill in the blanks for the rest. Huh? Oh, I included sai after hatachi cannot. Okay, uh, don't add the sai, it's, it's wrong. Yeah, just hatachi or two. Okay, if you type the dictionary hatachi, right, you get the kanji er shi sui, yeah. So this is included already. Yeah, so don't add the side. Only that only this special age are very somehow have to memorize. Okay. Let me give you the answer for the rest uh, for those who did not respond. Say, yeah. Right? Hatachi is written as er shi sui in, in kanji, is it? But yeah. it's pronounced hatachi. hatachi. Correct, correct. Thank you. Alright. Yeah. Okay, a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit unique la, A bit special. Okay, there are some special cases uh, A lot la, actually. Like this kanji uh, Some of you all may know la, This kanji. Okay, this N five kanji, but uh, it's rare as ashta. 
Okay, Ashta, tomorrow one. Okay, uh, you cannot say this one is Ashi, this is Ta, or this Ah, uh, that one is Shita. There's no such thing. Man. It's just the whole thing is rare as Ashta. Yeah, so Hatachi is a bit like that case. Uh. It's, a bit, it's a bit tricky, but those are very few cases. Yeah. Okay, N5, we don't have much about that. Yes. Uh, each list is available in the white book. Uh. Mm, let me think. Uh. I think don't have it. You all those who have the white book can you all check. I think don't have, right? Yeah, I also don't know why I don't have. Should, should have, but anyway, for my for my class, I usually print out for you all. Yeah, so who, yeah, those class that don't have the each list, uh, let me know. I have the soft copy. I'll just send to you by, by WhatsApp. Okay, I'll send you by WhatsApp. Huh? Okay, it's a bit special. Huh? It's follow numbers, but 1, 8, 10 is double S. Uh, okay, I send you a list and you will understand. Okay, we, we, we did that for the last two lessons already. We didn't say don't have so much, we don't have really. Okay, uh, Juba, uh, okay, maybe I'll let the next next few people to try. Okay, I start at Keith, right? Keith Khan, okay, Keith Teo, Keith Teo San, uh, Juba, number 10. Okay. It's a mess, huh? so you all need to rewatch to understand a bit also. KP San Lip, okay, All right, Juba. Oh, number 10 is it? Hmm, number 10. Hey. This is Desuka? Very good. Kore mo sensei no desuka? Okay, anyone forget about mo already? Textbook lesson one we did, right? We replaced the wa with mo to become oso or tu. Okay? Tu or oso. Okay, or Chinese is ye yeah for mo. So, zhe ye shi lao shi de ma. Okay, or this also teaches, alright? Okay? This also teaches. This is also teaches. Yeah. That's, that's answer. Okay? At 11, uh, keep this up, can you try? Okay, um, yes, sorry, wa gakusen no desu. Hmm, very good, yeah, sorry, wa gakusen no desu. Very good, okay, sorry, wa is optional. Yeah, it's a bracket for you, uh. so half or don't have, it's still full marks. I can't see beyond 14, oh, there's no 14, Four, uh, you mean 15, huh? 15 is next slide, I think. There's no more 15, really. I'm going back to 10 and 11, sorry, I'm still at 10 and 11. Is it uh it may be lagging, uh, it may be lagging. Some of you may may see nothing uh, but yeah, it's always you see it? Oh, do you see it's uh it's not lagging really sometimes. Also it's still on the same page. Yeah, we're still on the same page, yes. Oh, okay, sorry, sorry. Yeah. Right. Okay, so uh, I'm going back to the blanks. Uh. Okay, uh, additional info, I'm not I'm sorry it's very messy, yeah, uh, but Gaku say the kanji is Yeah, just write down, okay? Yeah, so, uh, Okay, uh, I need to repeat again. Uh, uh, N5 kanji, right, is optional to know now. Uh. It's optional. Okay, E1, we won't test you any about kanji. Okay, we still have to introduce to you because, like I showed you in previous slides, uh, everywhere is kanji in Japan. Uh. Yeah, I know, I understand there's uh, some, there always, every class will have at least one uh, non-Chinese student. Yeah, but, but not to worry. Yeah, my, all my non-Chinese students are very hardworking. They memorize the uh, kanji by heart. Like how we do in primary school, right? Si zi, uh, I just keep writing. Okay, or you somehow find a way to memorize because JLPT is all MCQ. Okay, MCQ means you don't need to write. Yeah, sometimes I write kanji, also will write wrongly. So that, that's how it is, huh? like Chinese. Like that, huh? Okay. Hey, uh, Johnny san, Ju san ban, 13. Hey, uh, hi, sorry, uh, Bishon, uh, number 14, right? Hey? Yeah, you're back, huh? Okay, good. Uh, yeah, sorry, I'm back. <laughs> okay, oh, no. oh, number 13. Okay, uh, so, watashi wa ni ju shi sai. Okay, watashi wa. Okay. Ni ju shi sai. Okay, ni ju shi sai. Okay, rarely, we rarely use the shi for H. Huh? Uh, you want to try again? Uh, ni ju yong, right? Ni ju yong, yeah. yes. Ni ju yong sai. Oh, ni ju yong. Okay. okay ni, ni ju yong sai. You cannot say cannot, uh, but um, this one better. Uh, ni ju yong sai. Okay. If you all have your number list uh, somewhere in your book, right? We have yong, we got shi. Okay, we usually use the left one as numbers. When to use right side, the shi. Uh, uh, certain cases that will be learned in the future. Okay, yeah. So ninju yon side desk. Okay. Um, let me ask the class. Watashi wa ninju yon side desk. Right. Hope you all can see at the bottom. Huh? What thing is optional? What What can you take out? Okay. What can you? Okay. Watashi wa. Very good. Okay. Watashi wa. I can take out. Okay. There's one more thing you can take out. Anyone remember? One more thing. That take out already. The meaning still the same. Okay, yes. Okay, Jaren I mentioned Sai. Yes, you can take out Sai. Uh. Okay, of course, uh, it must be a response to the question, how are you? Nan Sai desu Niju Yon desu ken. Okay, the difference is I'm 24 and I'm 24 years old. Okay, it, it's acceptable. Okay, yeah. If, if they never ask you how are you, you just say 24. It can be, uh, it's number 24. So be careful. 
Yeah, depends on context. Okay, it works. Okay, very good. That's your 2.1 done. Okay, uh, 2.1, the second half, right, is all open-ended. Uh. So let me just ask a few students, okay, no right or wrong on uh, this one. Unless the grammar is very, very wrong. Uh. Okay, let me have the next person. That it, who's next? Uh? I think just now was KP san. KP no Tsugiwa. Eh, eh. Uh, KT, now KT san. Hi, Anatawa, Nihonjin deska. Yeah, Watashiwa Nihonjin. Watashiwa Nihonjin dewa arimasen. Very good. Okay, yeah, Watashiwa Nihonjin dewa arimasen. All right, they want full marks answer. Correct, let me have the next person. Oh, same question. Uh, Lila, Lila san? Hey, Anata wa Nihonjin desu ka? Hai, watashi wa Nihonjin desu. Hmm, correct. Hai, watashi wa Nihonjin desu. Okay, so of course I'm not gonna question you or anything. As long as grammar correct is correct already, okay? Yeah, Nihonjin desu. Okay, so this one I mean by open-ended. So we can have many, many answers. Okay, there are some answers like, eh, Hai, so desu. Hai, ie. So there were arimasen. Ie, watashi wa Singapore jin desu. Okay, there's there's no limit lah. Usually I will mark for you uh, but yeah, now now yeah. Okay, just just don't don't worry. Okay, what's your name? Namai wanan desu ka? Oikutsu. Yeah, it's the same as Nansai. How old are you? Again, this one no right or wrong. You want to fake your age? Doesn't really matter. Okay, Kaisha no namai wanan nan desu ka? Kaisha is company. What is your company's name? Means where are you working at? Okay, but what if you are schooling? How do us? What what's your school? Where's your school? Okay, what change? Yeah, I think most should know. Uh. You just change Kaisha to Gakko. Okay, Gakko no namai wa nan desu ka? Okay, what is your name of your school? Yeah, it works also. Okay, sensei wa donata desu ka? Okay, everyone can put some teacher's name, your teacher's name, or any fake name, doesn't matter. Okay, then wa wa nan man desu ka? Okay, usually we practice in the class. La. Okay, uh, usually uh, class by class ask, uh, ask everyone for their number. So you need to know how to read your eight digits number. Huh? Okay. Yeah, read and understand also, but uh, yeah, usually in class, of course, we have your attendance with your number. I can test you all, but now it's a bit difficult. Okay, don't worry about that. Okay, so all the voc all this vocab is on your textbook. Okay, except for some of the ob object that's not in textbook. Huh? For example, 14. I know some already sent me what you have done, which is correct. Huh? I have checked already. So, special speciality is send more. Huh? Means uh, expertise, speciality, or your line. That means you are in the engineering line, your field basically, or your, or your major. Okay, you major in engineering or IT or what? You can just send on. Okay, right. Watashi no send on IT desk, for example. Okay, your send on is zhuanmen na zhuanmen is IT or anything that you can see. Okay, uh, chair all this is in our vocabulary. I think S3 we also did that high zara right? Okay, textbook don't have, but the practice we did last lesson have high zara. Okay, everything else is for you to fill in now uh, to see how much you remember from your lesson two. Okay, 2.2, more of this one. Hmm, should I continue? Okay, I'll just continue since everyone get the chance to answer. Okay, next, let me have. Hmm. Okay, Levin, Levin. Levin san, hi, Levin chan. Ichiban, hi. Skip, uh, okay, I'll skip you. Uh, uh, Zavian san, Zavian san, are you there? The tennis skip also. Savian? They have pronounced correctly. Where am I now? Savian looks Okay, now I go to uh, Marion. Marion, can you help me with number one? Hey, Yamada san wa nan sai desu ka? Okay, very good. Okay, Yamada san wa nan sai desu ka? Okay, Correct. Okay. Uh, additional info, Yamada kanji is this. Yamada. Okay, the da is the same da as a Honda, the da, right? And Yama is mountain. Okay, you'll learn that very soon also, but i show you N5. Okay, N5 again is the first hundred. Usually a few strokes only. Okay, everyone can learn that one by one. Because you'll keep seeing them again and again. Yeah, especially Japan is a mountainous area. Okay, very good. Okay, of course, we can also say Oikutsu desu ka. It works also. Sorry, I forget the car here. Right, Niban, let me have the next person. Uh, Nicholas, Nicholas. Hello, can you hear me? Yeah, hi. Uh, I don't know how to say he. Uh, anata Sanju go sai desu. Okay, Sanju go sai desu, very good. Anata is you, ah? Uh? 
Uh, so, I'm not sure how to say he in Japanese. Okay, no worries. The rest roughly no one. Okay, I write that for you, don't worry. Yeah. Okay, somebody replied you correct. Okay, kare wa? Yeah. Kare wa is he. Kare is he la. Okay. So again, uh, lesson one we did the I, you, he, she, they, them, us, all this, right? Okay. Ni wa ta la all this. Watashi anata kare kanojo. Okay, it's in the lesson one vocab. Don't worry, I'll just write up then. Start to record it, right? Okay, Saman, let me have. Kare wa, uh, usually kare is, is male only, la, yeah, usually it's male. Okay, usually it's male, yeah, New, neutral, yeah. Actually, a bit a bit tricky eh, because of the Chinese also. Eh. Your kare tachi, right, they tamen, eh. although it can be female also, but we use the male kare. La. Okay, but anyway, it's for, for male, la, okay, for, for elementary. Okay, how about she and it? Okay, there's no it. Okay, even Chinese, Chinese got it, right? I know Chinese got it, uh. it, it is a dog, right? This Chinese got this ta, and the it is for animal. But uh, we are uh, Japanese. We just repeat the thing again. Like you don't say kare wa ni sanju go sai desu. We say oh Yamada san wa sanju go sai desu. We repeat the person's name to be polite. Okay, if you don't know the person name, sometimes we say the uncle or auntie. We we try not to use the you. Uh, it's, it's quite rude. That kind of thing. Uh. Okay, we repeat the noun again. We don't have the it also. Yeah. Okay. Or as a matter as a matter of fact, uh, sorry, I, I you should omit this one. Uh, because we know who we're talking about already. So we can omit the he and she conveniently. Okay. Okay. Right? For for elementary of us, uh, we just use he and she uh, because we need to teach you the basics first. Yeah. Then when you go to Japan, it's a bit slightly different, but you'll get used to it. Okay. She is Kanojo. Kanojo. Uh, which uh, we come come to number four later. Okay, mm -hmm. I think most of y'all remember, right? Okay, number three. Sorry, let me go to the next person. After Nick would be Nico. Nico, son, can you reach that energy? Okay. Um. Okay. Mm -hmm. Anata mo sensei no namai des namai desu ka? Yeah. Anata no sensei no namai. Okay. So far, so good. Ah, huh? namai. Okay. Are uh, you missing the what part? Yeah. Okay. Desu. If you don't, yeah. Sorry. Desu ka? Yeah. Okay, just now you say something like uh Anata no sensei no namai desu ka? It means uh is is it your teacher's name? Oh. Yeah, okay, but don't worry what let me help you, huh? Okay, Anata no sensei no namai wa nan desu ka? Okay, so the subject is your teacher's name, very good. Then the question is what? Nan desu ka? Okay. Okay, okay, it's just like uh, I replaced the Anata no sensei no namai with kore. Kore is what? What is Kore? Everyone? This. This, right? So actually, this is what? Then I changed the this to teacher's name. Teacher's name is what? That's all. Okay? So it's a bit like our A. A wa nan desu ka? What is A la? Okay, your A is your teacher's name. So what is your teacher's name? Okay? Yeah, so that's the format of asking the... You can change to your your brother's name, your sister's name. Just change and say what do. Okay? Yeah, that's the answer. Getting one of the first time we seeing this type of question. Okay, so very good try, Nico. Okay, next, uh, Kuroki san, Kuroki. Um, Kanojo, uh, Kanojo no, Namae wa Kimurai des. Hmm, very good. Okay, so you see the format is the same, huh? Okay, you see, uh, your teacher name is what? Her, her name is Kimura des, okay? Uh, Kimura des or Kimura san, uh, both are okay, lah. Okay, but maybe because it's teacher, you can put the son also can. Okay, it's optional. Huh? Okay, it really depends on situation because uh, you, you watch anime, you know, you watch two high school people talking, uh, they won't add a son one. Huh? Okay, so it depends on who you're talking to. All these are all called a hierarchy thing. Huh? You're talking to your teacher and you're talking to the boss and you're talking to your friend, family members. Slightly different. Okay, but I still give you the answer. Either son or no son is all full marks. Kanojoa, ah, okay, can you can just shortcut? She is Kimura, Kimura san, can that will be fine also. Okay, although you did not translate literally, which is fine. Uh, as a translator, you don't need to translate word for word. You don't have the her name, you just say she is Kimura. It works also in real life, okay? So we are a bit quite flexible, huh? Although this is a textbook answer. Uh. Okay, number five involving numbers, really. Okay, hope you don't scare your. Okay, uh, Ying Sang san, are you there? Goban? It'll be trickier now. Okay, then Ying Ying will go to number Lokuban, okay? Okay, it's unmuted but no sound. Okay, any, are you 
reading something? Can you help you a bit also? Anata no, what is key? Okay, key is kagi. Kagi wa nanban desu ka? Okay, so your key, key, kagi, nanban desu ka? Okay, what number is your key? So it looks something like that. Can any any questions or any any other answers? Okay, none that we did before, right? Last lesson, in fact, last two lessons, uh, your back is what number, the watch is what number. Okay. Can you so use far. the word kazu? Sorry? Can you use the word kazu? Kazu? Kazu for, for what? For key, yeah. For number. For number, oh, uh, yeah, can, uh, but very hard to use it with the, then the what put where? Yeah. Also, you can't replace it with nanban. You yeah, okay, correct, correct. Okay, kazu, it means like digit or suzu or something like that. Okay, mm -hmm. but the nanban, ban is number. Uh, nan mm -hmm. is what? Or Chinese will be ban will be hao. Uh. Okay, and nan will be ji, uh, ji hao. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that, that's the literally translated. Uh. So if you have the kazu, right, like suzu, uh, uh, like, yeah, can, cannot in this context. Uh. Yeah, it would be, it's like um, another word for number. Uh. Okay. Yeah, a bit higher level, uh, but. Okay, when do you use bango? Good question. Okay, Keith asked bango. That, that's where I'm coming to. Uh. Then how come bango is number? Ban also number, correct? Okay, so uh, bango is hao ma. So something like the kazu you mentioned, uh, hao ma. Okay, I don't know how to write ma, but anyway, it means number. We don't say nan bango. We don't say ji hao ma. You know what I'm saying? Okay, the ban is usually, uh, only use for after a number, ichi ban. It means e hao, ni ban, e hao. Number one, number two. Okay. In, then if you say ichi bango cannot because it becomes e hao ma. You know what I'm saying? We can only e hao. We don't e hao ma. Yeah. So it's a bit closer to Japanese or uh, it's Chinese. Uh. English both means number. You cannot translate properly. Uh. Okay. So this case, uh, bango is like your kazu uh, cannot. We, we cannot say nan bango or nan kazu. Something grammatically wrong. We just say nan ban. Because your answer is the same, same format, ichiban, niban, sanban. Yeah, we don't ichikazu, nikazu, uh, ichibango, something error there. Can't okay, you understand? Okay, but as a trans, both translated to number, that's the issue. So be careful of ban and bango. Okay, so the example is uh, denwa bango. It appears in noun. Uh. Okay, denwa bango is actually phone number. Okay, like tianhua hao ma. We don't say tianhua hao. Yeah, if you say denwa ban, uh, it, yeah, a bit doesn't make sense also. Uh. Okay, hope it's not more confusing than before. Yeah, okay, maybe news. I think textbook got some examples later we go to there. Okay, so uh Ying, can you give us the number document? Okay. Ying, are you there? Okay, it's not uh yeah. Okay, I'll just give you the answer. Huh? Okay, uh, usually uh, you just need to say Yon Doku Hachi des. Okay, this is your answer. Okay, your subject, you can just copy from here if you want. Watashi no kagi wa Yon Doku Hachi des. Okay, you want to say Watashi no kagi bango wa, also can. Kagi no bango wa Yon Doku Hachi des. Okay, any other answers? This one really got a lot more answers. Huh? If only got more space, huh? I can write out everything. But yeah, okay. Mm, okay. Okay, this is the shortest answer. Huh? If not, you can copy this one. Watashi no kagi wa. Okay, my key is 468. Okay, do you say yon des? Or just yon roku des? Which one do you think is correct? Do you read the hundreds and tens or just 468? What do you all think? I think you do just tell the digits. Huh? You don't mm, tell your phone number in millions. Correct, correct. Okay, so yes, actually the digits would be better, lah, would be easier. Okay, all those uh, three, two, three digits still not too bad. Yeah, but sometimes a uh, certain context we use individual, just like you mentioned your handphone number, right? You say 9231, we don't say 9 million, 245,000, yeah, that kind. And I think like unit numbers, we can just use number. Okay, but sometimes hundreds, uh, some people say they may say hundred, lah, but you know, plus minus. Okay, as it gets longer, right, uh, you all react accordingly. Yeah, <laughs> okay, I, I believe a uh, handphone, yeah, I think key number, it depends. Okay, 50 50. Yeah, I prefer personally prefer individual digits. Okay. 
two digits still not too bad, right? Oh, my key number is 25. It's two five. Two digits, I think it's more, it's fine. Three digits onwards, I think individual better. Okay, again, this kind of no, no right or wrong. Lah. Okay, but uh, we see which are more convenient, okay? All right, number seven. Let me go back to the start of the class where we finally went wrong already. So roughly, I know who, who is MIA already, but it's okay. Or oh, not able to speak, it's fine. Okay, so uh, Alvin, Alvin San, Nana Ban, let's go to seven. Uh, hi, Korewa. Uh, the show desk. A book. Hon, Hon desk. Okay, book. Hon, Hon, Hon desk. Okay, Hon desk. Is this a book? You think you're missing something? Uh, Anata. Hmm, correct. Okay, your you right. Anata no Hon desk. Is this your book? Okay. Okay, and. Ayo, anata no hon desu ka? Can, okay, your kore wa optional again. Huh? Okay, all this in real life is optional because uh, we are pointing at the book, uh, I'm sure. Okay, hon kanji is what? This one. Okay, you all can write that if you want. Yeah, okay, and five kanji. Huh? Okay, number eight. Uh, Brian, Brian, sir, can you try number eight? Uh, hi, Des. Sorry, hi, Des. Yeah. Okay. Okay, hi, Des are grammatically wrong for Japanese. Just need one more thing you'll need. Oh, so this. Ah, okay. At oh. least so this. Okay. Hi. So this. Or any other answer? Okay. Right now for everyone. Uh. Hi. Hondas. Okay. Or hi. Watashi no Hondas. Okay. The Hondas, I think the one. Uh, very, doesn't sound very nice. Yes, it's book. Okay. It's, yes, it's mine. Or it's my book. Kim, okay. a Hon can optional. Hi. Watashi no this. Yes, it's mine. Okay. Subject is me now. Uh. Or hide so there's okay. We cannot hide, we cannot hide there uh, because grammatically before death must have something, must have something. Okay, must have a noun at least, right? Or adjective. Uh. Next time we learn oishi des, right? Kawaii des. But for nouns, for now it's all nouns, right? Nihonjin des, sensei des, kakusei des, yeah, and so des, hon des. Okay? Yeah, this is just grammar thing, uh, but very good. Okay, we can understand you. Okay, cadence, cadence, and Cuba. Yeah, this. Hmm, yeah, Tanaka san no this. Correct. Okay, some of you may put the book, uh, but they omit it already uh, because they say it's his. Okay, it's his book. Okay, Korewa Sorewa also omitted already. He's all correct. Very good. Right, Tsugi, Juban. Juban, let me have a uh, Koko, Koko san. Okay, you can tap out if you want. Uh. I don't know how this card. Okay, Koko san, are you there? Yeah. Hi, sorry. Mm, no problem. Uh, okay, very good. Okay, correct. Okay, from our textbook greetings, we have the Arigato gozaimasu, right? Okay, and I told my class before, uh, there's a lot of variation of thank you. Okay, you can just say Domo, or you can say Arigato, which everyone knows, uh, Arigato. Okay, there's a dash, uh, you all know why there's a dash, right? Okay, long vowel, uh, you need to drag a bit longer, that's all, Arigato. Okay, or Domo. Arigato or Arigato gozaimasu. Okay, plus minus. Uh, you want to copy the whole thing also, can? Okay, although it's very long winded, but for practice, you can write out the whole thing. Okay, very good. Uh, Ilo, Ilo san. Uh, yes, do itashimashite. Okay, so you uh, copy from the textbook, uh, the greetings are do. Yeah, yeah. Do itashimashite. Uh, what's the difference between this and Iwanai Day? Okay, very good. Uh, the Iwanai there, uh, those who put Iwanai there, uh, confirm it's Google Translate. Right? <laughs> okay, I saw a couple did that. Uh, okay, uh, Iwanai there uh, means don't say. Okay, so Japanese, uh, they translate, if you go Google, uh, they will translate literally. Uh, don't say it, don't mention it. Iwanai there is don't say. Yeah, so so you know what I'm saying? Okay, so, so uh, my, I always tell my class, uh, Google Translate 95% correct. Okay, sometimes you translate all the words are correct, uh, but Japanese don't say such thing. Okay, Iwanai that means uh, uh, PS4, something like that, or uh, don't say. Yeah, so. So, that it's don't actually even the, use in the, the, the normal, like, the lingo, right? Yeah, 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 something like that. We don't say that. So, it's not a correct response to thank you very much. Uh. Although, English it works. English it works, right? Yeah, don't, don't, don't mention it, uh, something like that. Yeah, but you know, Chinese is also there, cannot say don't mention it. Yeah. Is there a shorter so version the, of Doita Shimashite? 
that people... Ah, uh, yes, we just... Yes, there is. We just said yet only. Yeah, this one I also told my class. Okay? You can either say yet or do itashimashu. You don't have to say both. Either this or that, okay? Uh, because why we give you both? Because textbook, they want you to do a complete sentence. Okay? Yet do itashimashu, full stop. Yeah, proper, proper, proper speaking. Okay, but in real life, Japanese don't talk so long. Okay, it's like you learn English, right? They say, uh, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. These are the textbook answers, lah, which we show you. But in real life, uh, a bit a bit different. Okay, so different, how, how different is in a way they just say yeah. Lah. Okay, let me ask the class again, what is yeah? No. 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 Right, okay, so I also told my class about the story. I, I tell, I say thank you very much to my cousin's daughter. Then she said yeah. Then I, like, when, I was, when I was young, like, how can she say no? But actually, she don't mean don't, don't want, uh, she means don't need, uh, no need. Yeah, so it's not like rejecting my thank you, uh, it's really, it's don't worry about it, something like that, uh, okay? So this is something we don't encourage one word answer lah, like yet. Yeah. But talking is fine, right? Talking hi, yet, yeah, yeah, it's fine. Okay. And please wait a minute. I think some of you also Google translated, which I'm gonna go through right now. Who's turn is it? Uh, Gabriel, Gabriel son, can you try? Okay, it's not most most you know. Uh chotomate kudasai. Okay, very good. Chotomate kudasai. Okay, this one I don't know. I think textbook don't have, although I may have taught my class. Okay. Uh Chotomate could ask, right? Anyone got other answer? Anyone? I asked, uh, anyone got the Ipun or not? Ipun, right? You see somebody posted Ipun Mate could ask, right? You know what's Ipun? <laughs> okay, Ipun. I think Choto Sumimasen. Oh Choto Sumimasen is uh excuse me. Yeah, excuse me and please wait uh slightly different. Okay, the Choto Sumimasen we mentioned was the hmm, I mean, ask, catch someone's attention. Yeah, you ask, you need help from the waiter or waitress or the shop person. You say, like, Choto Sumimasen, excuse me a while. Okay, but Choto Mate is uh, wait a while. Huh? So, uh, yeah, somebody mentioned Choto. Okay, Choto, uh, by right, is not wait, huh? so be careful. Uh. Choto is a little. Okay, Mate is the real wait. Huh? So you say Mate, uh, Mate is the correct one to, to be waiting. Choto is adverb, it's not the, the verb wait. Okay, Kudasa is. Please. Okay, go back to Ipun. Uh. Ipun, if you type dictionary Ipun, you get this one. It literally means one minute. Okay, if you want someone to wait one minute, you can. You say Ipun Mate Kudasa, I can. Ipun Mate. I think somebody mentioned uh, Ipun Mate. Is it? Yeah, Ipun Mate Kudasa. Yeah. I think KP is I mentioned. I think more than one, more than one of you all did this answer. Uh, some of you all WhatsApp me already. So, yeah. <laughs> Okay, can so it's either you choto mate or ipun mate because you don't want to wait a little one minute, you don't want a little and one minute together. It's either one minute or a little. Okay, so I write here. Sorry, yeah, ipun mate could as I can. This is wait one minute, choto mate is wait a little, and everyone say wait a little, choto mate. Everyone heard that before, right? Okay. So, what if I don't could as I okay, no could as more informal. La. Okay, not say it's rude, but it's more informal. La. Okay, so you uh, can ask me, question. Uh, what is the difference between Choto and Scotch? Uh, both are the same. Uh, both means a little. Okay, very good. The, 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 these are different adverbs of the same meaning. Yeah, you learn that very soon. Okay, that's a good question. Yeah, so there's a Choto and a Scotch. Yeah. Scotch is a little. La. It's a bit like, you know, a bit, a little, a while. This kind of uh, talking about the same thing. Yeah, both can be used. But Mate, this word, we usually use Choto Mate. La. We usually use Choto Mate. Okay, so I'll uh, give you an example. Uh, okay, an uh, adjective called atsui, uh, atsui, hot. Okay, we can say uh, sukoshi atsui, a little bit hot. We can say choto atsui, a little bit hot. Both same. Okay, both are okay. Yeah, both are okay. So interchangeable. But mate, we usually use choto. As you all know, uh, we always hear choto mate. Right? Okay, we don't hear sukoshi mate. Yeah. Okay, both works also. Okay, that's a good question. Wow, finally we are done. Oh, still got some more. Huh? Okay, still got some more homework. Okay, I just give you the answers uh, for those who have tried. Those who haven't tried, you can try some more. Okay, kore wa uh, hai zara desu ka? Okay, hai, so that's hai zara desu. Okay, the clue is where? It's here. It's, it is an uh, asterisk. Okay, so wa blank desu ka? Ie hon de wa arimasu. Okay, I give everyone five seconds to think about it. It should be quite easy. Okay, some haven't tried, you can take five to ten seconds to think about it. Huh? Okay, ah, so wa hon desu ka? Okay, is that a book? No, it's not a book. Quite straightforward. Okay, the clue is on the right side. Are wa Blank desk, Larger desk is a radio. Okay, what is the question? What should be the answer? 
Okay, the answer, there are two answers. Huh? None deska. Anyone put Jisho deska? No, did that. Okay, is that a dictionary? No, sorry, what dictionary? It's a radio, huh? Lajo. <laughs> yeah. Okay, the, the spelling about the same. <laughs> okay. Anyway, any anyone put Lajo? No? Okay, why must be none deska? Huh? Okay, I can I can tell you textbook answer is none, but I'll accept both why. Okay, if you say Arewa Lajo deska, your you must answer hi Lajo des. You see the difference already? Okay. Yeah, if you ask, is that a radio? Then it's a yes or no question. Then you can say, yes, it's a radio. Okay, but now it's not a yes or no question. It, it is, what is that? Okay, Arewana Deska, what is that? It's a radio. Okay, keep confusing. Okay, any, any questions regarding this? Okay, Sorewa Boru Pen Deska. You have to give your answer. Boru Pen Deska. Is that a ball pen or a pen? Okay, that's how you use all. We learned that before. Is that a ball pen or a pen? Boru Pen Desk is a ball pen. So there are uh Dare no Hondeska. This is whose book? Kimura no Hondes. Okay. Typo I think. Kono Jisho mo Kimura san no deska. Okay, is this also Kimura san's? No. Yeah, Kimura san no dewa adimas. Okay, it's not Kimura's. Eh, ano camera wa Dare no deska. Let us check your different answers, huh? Yamoto san no des. Okay, whose camera is that? Kono kama wa anata no deska. Is this yours? Yes, it's mine. Hi, so that's what I know. Okay, let me see your different answers. Some of you are here. Can number four be none deska? Number four be none deska? Eh? Uh, a bit difficult because uh, uh, actually can uh, can uh, you know why not? Uh, what is that? A pen? Ah, uh, can also. Okay, all these are something that uh, in real life it's okay. Okay, although I have terrible textbook answer is bottle pen. Okay, because uh, question four, right? Sorewa A deska. Okay, this is very elementary. La. So you all have different answer, it's higher level and acceptable. So okay. Sorewa A deska, B deska, is this A or B? Then your answer is this A des. Yeah. Okay. So it, it yeah, textbook answer. Sorry, I don't okay. Okay, you double check any different answer, please feel free to share. Okay, all right, so I'll go to the Finally, you can start lesson three already. Okay, so homework is to revise lesson one and two, not lesson three. Okay, hiragana, uh, we have learned to wear it. Okay, tachi to only four. Okay, okay. Okay, konshi wa kochi. Okay, this week we're gonna do this five. Okay, so technically one week five hiragana, right? Okay, so we had the number twenty. So to after today, you should have memorized twenty already. Okay, that means tachi to teto. Some sub becomes twenty. All this twenty. Okay, 20 out of 46, that's almost half already. In other words, your homework, you can start to write hiragana. Okay, yeah, no, uh, Romaji, less and less uh, as time goes by. Yeah, so please try to write in hiragana. Okay, let's try to write the tachisu that all together. Okay, uh, yeah, you all can use a blank piece of escape paper. Some of you already memorized already, just bear it us for a few minutes. Okay, so it looks like this. Okay, the head, right, is just two lines only. Okay, and inside there is a, what does this look like? What's inside? Ko. Ko, yes, okay. Inside looks like the ko that we looked right before, right? K-O, huh? okay, it's actually the same. Huh? So variation, you can also write like this. Okay, that means got a tick inside one. Huh? Got a tick is fine, okay, because of I explained to my class before, it's a uh, calligraphy, uh, they sometimes like that. Because they draw very fast, they leave a nice mark. Okay. All right, so can anyone uh, read what is this word? These two words. Taco. 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 Hey, taco. Taco. What is taco? Takoyaki. Ah, uh, taco is takoyaki. Very good. Correct. <laughs> yeah, it's your octopus. Okay, takoyaki octopus ball. Huh? So you go to Japan, you see taco. Okay, takoyaki. Okay, next chi. Uh, how do you write chi? Looks like that. Okay, usually my line go downwards a bit. Uh. Don't know why I printed it's not. Okay, what does it look like? Okay, some say it looks like a. Uh, it something looks like five uh, plus minus uh, okay uh take note it looks like a reflection of of what sa yeah it looks like a reflection of sa so chi and sa looks like opposite only except uh, sa sa you can separate that means not join okay chi you can never separate okay it's only two strokes this one and then like that like that okay 
Yeah, again, I told you before, I write a few, I write 10 times, all looks slightly different, doesn't matter. Okay, Kitagana is quite linear, flexible. The teacher can understand, means can understand. Okay, if uh, kanji is different, uh, but never okay, it's one stroke only, so just like that. Okay, one line like that. Okay, bottom slightly smaller, uh, shorter than the top, that's all. Okay, if you go to see them, very HD one, uh, they got a few curve one, uh, but no need so much, because uh, if I write composition again, just quickly write like that. Okay, all are correct, uh, all are correct. Okay. Anything you can Google, uh, some you can see variations of uh, this kind of writing, but usually the everyone can recognize them. Uh. Okay, Ted, Hung, then like that. Okay, yeah, just like that, just like that. Okay, again, and practice writing a few more times. Okay, practice writing on your homework, uh, that will be better. Okay, so Ted is this, right? We always write our sentence end with this one, right? How to read this? That's it. Very good, that's it, right? That's it. Okay, that's okay. How come Ted? Tear with two dots become that. Uh, it's just the two dots, right? T becomes D, K becomes G with two dots. Okay, S becomes Z. Okay, this kind we keep seeing as time goes by, it gets easier. Yeah, tear and that. Okay, to to two lines, one like that, one like that. Okay, it's a forty-five degree on the top. Okay, and then you just do a C plus minus. Okay, yeah, all are correct. Okay, the last three characters very easy Just just one two strokes only. Okay, right. Please go back to practice, uh, practice at home. Uh, right? I think a few more times will do. Okay, again, hiragana is a Japanese cursive alphabet. Uh, it's just very cute characters. Uh. Cute ABCs. Okay, let me go to the next slide. Okay, numbers, bango. Okay, or suji, uh, suzi. Uh, I think some, uh, yeah, numbers got a few different tran translation uh, numbers. Some yeah, some say kazu, right? Also can be numbers, I think. Okay, but anyway, like, Okay, so your the those not my class one, you all remember your until thousands or not? Until millions, you still remember? Okay, um just a quick revision now. Uh, because we do for the past three lessons already. But you all probably did also, but that was a few months ago, right? Okay, hundreds, let me ask the class. Uh, you can just type out, okay, just spam the chat, it's okay. Or you want shout out also can. How to say three hundred? Yeah, I choose all the special cases, huh? Okay, y'all can just think while I write also. No, no issue. Y'all can uh, answer in your mind, uh, don't worry. San Byaku. Okay, make sure it tallies, huh? Because never use forget it, yeah. Okay, San Byaku. Very good. How to say 600? Okay. By now, y'all should instantly show you no know already. Lah. Okay, so I just write out while y'all think. Uh, Lo Byaku. Hey, Lo Byaku. 800? Ha Byaku. Okay. Can. All right, of course, the rest of the hundreds are just number and hyaku, right? Right, hyaku, ni hyaku, san hyaku, yon hyaku. Okay, all this in your textbook. Uh. That's why this lesson, I don't have hundreds because we went through past few lessons already. Okay, thousand special cases, um, 3,000. Right, sen, ni sen, san sen, yon sen, go sen, doku sen, nana sen, has sen, double S. Has sen, q sen, okay? 1,000, we can also say isen. Okay, isen. So uh, double S in one and eight, uh, these are for your S counters. What I mean by that? One year old also, right? East side. Okay, eight years old, half side. Okay, this one I will need to send to some of you because some of you all don't have the H list, uh, so don't care what I'm saying right now. Okay, so 1,234. Let me call people to answer it. Okay, so don't, let me know if you're not comfortable, want to skip. Uh. Was Gabriel the last one, right? Okay, let me go to the next person. Mm -hmm. Who's next? Uh? You all let me know because I cannot. Gabriel, no, to you. Gabriel. So I just go up and down. Okay, uh, Glenn, Glenn son, would you like to try one, two, three, four? Uh, sen ni hyaku sanju yon desu. Okay, very good. Okay, sen ni hyaku sanju yon. Okay, so I don't need to write out really. I hope everyone can understand. Okay, thousand is here. Sen ni hyaku 200 sanju yon. Very good. Okay, let me have the next person. So you always listening skills also. See your friend got read wrongly, okay? So uh, Ian, Ian san, can you read the uh, two four six nine? Nisen yon hyaku rokuju chu. Hmm, very good. Okay, Nisen uh yon hyaku rokuju q. Very good. Okay, so I just roughly write out. Huh? Nisen. Okay, this is the kanji for thousands. Huh? I think I told my class before. Okay, and the thousand for hundred kanji for hundreds is yon hyaku. Okay, you all should know this hyaku. Huh? I hope you all can recognize. Cannot also never mind. Right then, Roku Ju Q. It's very Chinese because uh, if you really want to write all in kanji, it's supposed to be 2400. 
Okay, Liu Shiji. Okay, all these are your first few kanji you have to know. Lah. Yeah, anyway. Mi Sen. Okay, Yon Hyaku. Lokuju Q. Yeah, this some will not be. Okay. When you write, when you talk about years, like 2020, yeah. 2020 do you use uh, 20, like thousands as well? Or good, you are right. Uh, good question. Yes, you have to read out everything. That means you 1999, you need to say 1999 men. Yeah. Correct. Instead of 1999, is that what you're asking? Yeah. Yeah, yeah correct, correct. You need to read the thousands out. Yes. Yeah, Nissan men. Yeah. The year 2000, correct. You don't. 2000, yeah, we need to read the thousands, hundreds, uh, and tens. Okay. Although Japanese, right, they go by different year, you all know, right? Now is what year already? Actually, I'm also not very sure. They change to Lewa. They go by their own king's period, you all know? Last time was Heisei. In the last, more popular one would be what? Meiji era, Showa era. They go by the calendar year. La. But of course, due to business, they also use the Westerners, uh, 2020. Okay. Yeah, that one will be in the time lesson, lesson six, uh, which I'll tell you more in the future. Okay. Uh, three, 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 got it. So give another, let me see. Ah, uh, Lewa period, yeah. Now it's a li, Ling He, uh, yeah, the Lewa period. Okay, now I lost already. Who's next? Yeah, yeah uh, Irina, Irina, so I think your turn, I think. San Zen, San Baku, San Ju San. Very good. San Zen, San Baku, San Ju San. Okay, all the special cases are 3000 is Z, uh, Z, San Zen. San Baku is a B. Okay, uh, Sanju San. Okay, so how do you all know all these numbers? You all just memorize, right? Okay, there's no other way. Yeah, you all just know. Lah. Okay, very good. Next, let me have uh, Jason, we want to try. Hasan, Haku, Hachiju, Hachi. Correct. Okay, Hasan, right? 8000 Hasan, uh, Hapyaku. Correct, Hapyaku over here. Huh? And Hachiju Hachi. Okay. Right, so we don't talk about numbers really. Uh, no, still things to have. Okay, so why if you go more than four digits? Okay, uh, as you all know, should know, very Chinese, huh? One million, uh, one million is right here, Coco Des. Okay, one million is Hyakuman. Okay, because Japanese and Chinese, our comma is here. After four digits on the right. Okay, after four zeros, huh? then we put a comma. And this group here is your man group. Okay, hence, uh, Hyakuman, 100 man, okay, 101, uh, it's like same in Chinese, huh? okay, English is the one, that the comma is here, okay, 1 million, right, every three, like three digits is one comma, okay, okay I think I went through this way, uh, so I'll just give you one example, okay, I think I'll give you one example first, uh, how do you say this, okay, I'll just quickly tell your answer, okay, you take a five seconds to think about the answer, sorry, 10 seconds, Okay, the answer is Hyakuni Ju San Man. Okay, it by us to San Man or 123 Man and 3000 Sunset. Okay, any question regarding this? Okay, I'm not other classes you did your numbers before, right? Let me know if you have not, uh, then I will touch on it a bit also. Uh. The number should be not not, not, not difficult, right? Okay, uh, yeah, you repeat that. The, the one I just mentioned, the numbers are. Yes. yes. Okay, so what happened is. Uh, uh, okay. I mean, just repeat the number. Oh, the numbers are okay. It's actually uh, 123 man. So, Hyaku, Niju, San, Man. Okay, you need to mention this first. Yeah, then it comes with a man. Okay, because this is a man group. So, uh, yeah, this is the man group. Uh. So, how about this number? Y'all can try. Okay, it's actually just 10 man, 1000 man. Okay, 1,000 man. Yeah. Okay, so, uh, yeah, we don't want to go on. Uh, go on further is another group. It's called Oku group. Uh. Okay, like I said, uh, you may need to use your economics. Uh, I think your GDP or this, or you buy property in Japan, then you will need that. Okay. okay, so far, so good. Okay, let me ask everyone question right now. Okay, wait, I stop just now. Is that right? Okay, Jenny, Jenny, yes, are you there? Yes. Right, uh, hon wa ikura desu ka? Hon wa ikura desu ka? Hon wa sen ni shaku en desu. Very good. Sen ni shaku en desu. Okay, recap again. Uh, uh, Japanese currency is this kanji. It is read as N, though which you read correctly. Very good. Okay, N. Okay. Not yen, uh, but of course you read fast. Uh. Ni shaku en. Shaku en. Sounds the same. Very good. Okay, so, so you are. 
Next, uh, Jer Jeron, Jeron san? Jer Jeron san, uh, MP2 wa ikura desu ka? MP2, sorry, uh, your note pencil is here. Jugo yen desu. Ah, Jugo yen desu, correct. Okay, so, Sanban, uh, Chaling, Chaling san, are you there? You know how to unmute? Kelly just now was not there, so Justin, Justin, are you there? Justin, uh, Sanban wa ikura desu ka? Sanban. Okay, I think. Okay, Joel, Joel, San, uh, okay. Okay, I can either ask you a uh, kaban wa, kaban back, uh, kaban wa ikura desu ka? Or I can say Sanban wa ikura desu ka? Both referring to the same thing, correct? Okay, how much is the back or how much is number three? All right, so Joel, uh, Sanban wa ikura desu ka? Kyusenihaku. Very good. Okay, Kyusenihaku, currency? Uh, yen. <laughs> I know yeah. it sounds like yen. Okay, okay. Uh, it usually we read N. Uh, nihaku en desu. Yeah, N. Uh. So don't worry, don't worry. Can you say yen now? Uh, we can understand. Okay, sen nihaku en desu. Okay. What if you say doru? What is doru? Dollar. Ah, okay. Dollar, huh? So, uh, hyaku doru is dollar. And dollar by default is USD. Huh? Okay, how do you say SGD? Singapore doru. Yeah, Singapore doru. Okay, just add a country behind the dollar, then it makes sense really. Okay, in case you want to change money in Japan. Hi, Yongban. Uh, next person. Um, yeah, Johnny, Johnny san. Uh, Yongban wan, ikura desu ka? Okay, yes, yeah, very cheap thing. Yonban wa ikura desu ka? Sorry, sorry. Yeah. Uh, which one? Uh, Yonban. Yonban wa ikura desu ka? No, oh, 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 the mesh thing. Okay. Yeah, correct. Juen. Uh, Juen desu, correct. Okay, very good. Machi. Okay, yeah, uh, usually in complete sentence, you need to have the desu. Uh, Juen desu. Yeah, Juen. but you have. Never mind, like, in real life conversation, they don't really, we don't really mind. Okay, Goban wa ikura desu ka? Kif, Kif Kang san? Uh, yeah, uh, Goban wa... Oh, this one, okay, <laughs> for now. <laughs> okay, the number get bigger. Right? Uh, Isan Roku Hyaku. Hmm? Roku Hyaku. Okay, you just say 600. 650? Yeah. Uh, you see the numbers? Can you see the number? Oh, uh, yeah. One, 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 six, five, oh, oh. Yeah. One, six, five, oh. Okay. Uh, Ichi, Nichiban. Ah, uh, Ichiman, correct. Okay, Iwan, uh, Ichiman. Yeah, yeah, Ichiban. Roku, Roku Hyaku. Uh, not Roku Hyaku, not 600, it's 6,000. Uh, Roku San. Roku San. Roku San. Roku San, yes. Roku San. Five. Go. Ju. Go. 100, uh, not 10. Uh. Go. Go Hyaku. Go Hyaku. Mm, go Hyaku Des, correct. Go Hyaku and Des. Oh, go Hyaku Des. Yeah, okay. okay. So careful, uh, Goju is 50. Uh. So this is 500. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay, very good. Okay, Lok Lokuman, let me have the next person. Tsukiwa. Where did I stop? Okay, Kiftio, Kiftio san. Terebi wa ikura desu ka? Terebi. Uh, Juyon man, gosen yen desu. Hmm, very good. Okay, Juyon man. Okay, we've solved the 14 first. Uh, Juyon man, gosen yen desu. Correct. Okay, Nanaban. Okay, Kiftio san. Ikura desu ka? Sashi. Hyaku, Hyaku roku ju yen. Very good. Hyaku roku juen desu. Very good. Hachiban, we go to uh, KT. KT san. Uh, Toke wa ikura desu ka? Toke wa ikura desu ka? Niman san sen lopyaku yen desu. Very good. Okay. Niman san sen lopyaku yen desu. Correct. Huh? Okay. Kyuban. Kyuban wa ikura desu ka? After KT san is uh, Lia. Lia san? Shinbun. Uh, Nara juen desu. Nara juen desu. Very good. Next, uh, Lavin, would you like to try Kamenawa Ikura desu ka? Lavin, don't let me ask you again. Okay, skip. Uh, uh, hey, uh, Zayvian, Zayvian, are you there? Zayvian-san? 
coming up. Yeah, go to Marion. I think just now both skip, right? Okay, Marion, hi. Ju, uh, Juban, come here. Sanzen. Mm, Nana. Zen. Hmm? Okay, I put a comma there. I put a comma there, yeah, so. Oh, sorry, sorry. That's yeah. a Sanan. <laughs> Sanan. Nana Zen. Nana Zen. Nana Zen. Uh, Very good. Happy Okay, correct. Sanman Nanasen Happy Correct. Okay. Sanman Chichen Papa. Very good. Jujiban in Nicholas. Tabako wa ikura desu ka? Nihaku Nana Ju and that's it. Nihaku Nana Ju and that's Okay, last one. Uh, Ichiban Takai no. Uh, the most expensive. Uh, Pauline, would you like to try? Juni Bama ikura desu ka? Jidosha. Okay, if not, I go to uh, Kuroki. Kuroki san, ikura desu ka? Jidosha. Um, hiyak. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, let me try again. Uh. Um, hiyak. Correct, it's a good start. Hiyaku is correct. Hiyaku go ju loku man. Correct. Hachi sen yen. Yes. Hasen. Hasen. Okay, that was a special case. Okay, so Hatsen, we don't say Hachisen. Okay, Hasen. Yes, Hasen. Yes. Okay, so this one we did. We see this picture for at least two, three times already. Yeah. So I think your number is more familiar, right? Okay, so let me go to the lesson three stuff now. Oh no, this is a conversation. Okay. Okay, I'm sure you all have your conversation in the page 30. I think San, Sanju Peiji. Okay, uh, Peiji is just, sorry, so Peiji is your page. Lah. Okay, Sanju page, page 30. Yeah, just roughly read to you all the conversation what is it about. Okay. Alright, so uh Taro san and Mendu san talking. Okay, a male Japanese and Singaporean female. Okay, so Tan san says Konnichiwa, Hajime Mashte. Let's recap. Huh? Okay, I didn't put the English definition here because I want you all to see your, how much you all recall, but you can refer to your textbook below it has the English. Right? What is Hajime Mashte? Hajime Mashte, when do you use Hajime Mashte? You can mention, right? Okay, so uh, first time meeting, correct? So uh, it says uh, how are you or something in translation, right? But Chinese, I think I told you before, it's your first time meeting. We say chu zi jian okay? So only use when you meet someone for the first time. They somehow say how are you or something like that. Acceptable, lah, because that's the English way of greeting someone you met first time, right? I think so. How are you? Eh? Nice to meet you or something like that. Okay, yeah, don't worry about that. Huh? Sorry. Uh, so what if we are meeting them for like like it's a familiar face, you know? Ah, correct, correct. What if what if you meet someone a second time or familiar face, right? What do you all think? How would you greet your friend? <laughs> okay, first of all, you cannot say Hajime much that there will be a problem. Oh, yeah. ayo, ayo. ayo, okay, yeah, just any greeting you want. Hello, Konnichiwa, can you ready? Or just hi, or just wave, yeah, all the normal greetings. Yeah, this is only for first time. So if you meet a second time, we oh. use. Ah, uh, Hisashi Buri also good one. Long time no see. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Alright. Then um. Okay. Watashi wa Tanaka to moshimas. Okay. Uh, to moshimas. Ah, I think your English. You all look at your book. You either the PDF version or the textbook, right? Okay. They say desk is seldom used, right? You all see that? Okay. Ah, uh, seldom used doesn't mean never used. Huh? So, but we prefer to moshimas. Huh? That one really sound a lot more fluent. Okay. But what we learned before last time was um. Uh, uh, watashi wa Tanaka this Yeah, it works also. I will use after the circuit breaker. Yeah, I can do that. <laughs> okay, uh, dozo yoroshiku onegashimasu. What is the translation for this? What you all think? Yeah, I'll just process a bit. This one is typical standard. Uh, Japanese introduce themselves. Uh, they will confirm use this one. Okay, they will start. Yeah, and okay, yeah, it's in your greetings. Okay, it's just nice to meet you. That's all. Okay, because we don't have perfect translation, otherwise Chinese we will say uh Ching Toto Yeah, Ching that kind of translation. Okay, please take care of me. Please guide me, please take care of me. Nice to meet you. You see English so far apart, but it works as a translator, it works. Okay. Alright, so the person will reply the same thing, Natashi wa Lin to Moshima. So of course you say Lin this also works, but we teach you a nicer one. To Moshima is more fluent. Kochira Koso. Kochira is referring to herself or himself, Lima herself. Kuchira is myself. Uh. 
Okay, Coachella is actually uh, direction. You will learn later. Okay, when pointing at myself, Koso is just emphasis on Coachella. Only, okay, all these are very high level grammar actually. Yeah, but they are there to show you some, uh, introduce to you some new things only. Lah. Okay, don't worry about all this kind of thing. Okay, those are your So it is me who should say, nice to meet you. Please take care of me. Okay. Next, Shitsurei desu ka? Shitsurei desu ka is uh, Shitsurei kanji is same as Chinese. Shili, uh. They, I think English, they put excuse me, right, or something. Okay, this excuse me is more like, uh, forgive me for being rude. Okay, forgive me for being rude. But, okay, this guy here is but. Okay, don't worry, your English, your book below got all the English, uh, you can refer and listen to me at the same time. Uh. Okay, uh, excuse me, uh, because Shili, uh, Shili in Chinese, is same as Japanese Shitsule, which is Shichi Li Mao. That means forgive me for being rude. Or I'm gonna be rude, but something like that. Okay. But Lim San wa gakusei desu ka? Okay, this sentence why they underline Lim San. Okay, is because they don't say anata wa gakusei desu ka. Okay, why we don't say anata? Okay, uh, for practice you can now. Okay, but I tell you Japanese don't do that. They don't like say you you quite rude. They repeat the person by the name again. Okay. Okay, if if you don't repeat or you forget the name, you just omit it. Gakusei desu ka? Can it works also? Okay, we don't like the ni ni. It's quite rude. Like if you go to talk to a random uncle, right? You say uh, anata wa nansai for example. Anata wa nansai desu ka? Uh, how old are you? Sounds very rude. You need to say oji san wa nansai desu ka? Uh, uncle, how old are you? You see the got the extra word uncle there or the the person's name would be a lot better than you. On yeah, ni ji sui a bit rude, right? Uh, at least Chinese we also say uncle ni ji sui something like that. Okay, you repeat the person's name again instead of using anatawa. Okay, but for elementary, huh, you use, use that is okay. Lah. Technically, it's quite a... It's, anata is supposed to be a good word one, but Japanese, uh, they tend to omit it. Okay, we're talking to someone. Okay, hi, so yes, yes, I am. Kakusei desu. Okay, this is just repeat. Lah. It's optional. Yes, I am. I'm a student. Okay, Tanaka-sawa. What is this wa? Can anyone roughly tell me? Tanaka-sawa. Okay, if you see English below, it says something like, uh, how about how about you, right? Okay. Chinese would be uh ni na, like that only. You, yeah, the kind Tanaka san. Sorry, Tanaka san is the person she's talking to. Uh, it's the Tanaka Taro. Okay, Tanaka san wa, Tanaka san na. Okay, uh does it make sense? Okay, then watashi wa kai shine desu. I'm a employee. Okay, this con conversation is a bit higher level. Uh, as you can see, a lot of underlines part uh, and new things to learn. Okay, you can just take a look and yeah, any questions you can ask me? Uh Sumima said. Uh then you know Shitsure. What is Shitsure Shimas? Ah okay. Shitsure and Shitsure Shimas same word ma. Okay, Shitsure Shimas is the verb. Shitsure is the noun. Okay? Yeah, it's just a shimas behind. Uh. It converts to a verb already. Shitsure shimas means uh, I'm doing it. Okay, shitsure des. Uh. Okay, it's just noun and verb equivalent. Because uh. noun we end with a des. Then verb we end with a mas. Yeah, it's the same thing. It's the same thing. You can use either. Yeah. So, but in this context, would you, you can't really use shitsure shimas. Uh, right. very weird eh? because shitsure shimas usually we use it like uh shiri you are doing uh it's a verb because you are already doing the action uh usually okay context wise right is like you leave before the boss uh. you will say at the door excuse me uh shiri uh shi pei le. okay that is more to shi pei la, I guess yeah but it's the same word actually so it's more like an expression uh, e the, rather than like a what you call it like a way to ask someone something. Yeah, correct, correct. Something something like what you say. Uh. I think uh, if you ask me, I sure we can think of the context is different, uh, but the meaning is actually the same word. Yeah. Okay. Right. So yeah. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, a bit tricky, uh, really very high level, uh, but yeah, I'm sure you all hear before Shitsule Shimas, right? Okay, some of you all may hear before like uh Chinese will translate to shi pei le la, so can, this is more to shi li, but that one shi pei also means shi li because of the word shi zi le la. Okay, so uh, yeah, a bit high level, so, so don't, don't worry about this conversation thing. La. Okay, so, uh, you experience some new stuff, right? If anything, you can continue to ask me, don't worry. Okay, let me go to the second conversation that you have in after lesson two at the end. Okay, maybe I'll let you all read line by line, then I'll explain, okay? Okay, so I'm gonna try to read a bit. I think it gets very long already. Hmm. Okay, I tell you what, because of time constraint, I think you all can read at your own. Okay. 
and there are questions for you to do after that. Uh, yeah, I just want to go to some important part. Okay, for example, uh, Lim san, uh, watashi no meshi desu. Meshi is name card. This is my name card. Okay, I think I have the everyone have the book, right? The English translation is below. Ah, uh. uh, domo arigatou gozaimasu. Ano, sumimasen. What's ano? Okay, just go through something. Yeah, okay, go through something. Ano is just um, uh, no meaning one. Okay, Japanese everyone talk about it. Ano, eto, here also got another one. Eto, um, okay, it's just, they call it fillers. Uh. Just, um, like English is um, right? Uh, yeah, no, no, no meaning. Okay, fillers. Huh? Sumimasen. Uh, sumi Tanaka sa no denshi meru desu ka? Okay, denshi meru is email. Uh. Is this Tanaka's email? Okay, again, you see, they don't say, kore wa anata no, they don't say, is this your email? They repeat the person name I'm talking to again. Kisana, Tanaka san. Okay. Is this Tanaka's email? It's being me nicer. Okay. Hi, so this. Demo. Okay, demo is but. Demo, kaisha no denshi meru no adores des. But is my company's emails adores. What's adores? Okay, okay. It's address. Very good. Okay, it's katakana, written katakana. But uh, as you can tell, if you know English, it's address. Okay, so it's... Uh, it's good we know some English. Okay, then is it Lim San no then she made one and deska? So what is Lim San's email? Then he mentioned this at the okay, it's in blue. Uh. This is the important part I want to tell you. How do they read this? Uh? Okay, we can try to read together. Okay, we read alphabetical one alphabet at a time. Uh. So you can just just follow after me. Uh. Okay, so let's read A to Z, let's learn A to Z together. Okay, A, B, C, D. E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z, Atomark, Dot. Okay, so that's how they sound. Uh. Hence, a lot of uh, very funny things are uh. like. I told my class before, Starbucks, how do they pronounce? Okay, Starbucks. Why like that? Because they don't have, uh, some. they cannot pronounce bucks. They don't have bucks. They only got, if you know your hiragana or katakana table, it's only have, we have su, we have ta, we have ba, we got ku, we got su. Okay, hence, hence uh, they say, it sounds weird, uh, even typo. Uh. Japanese pronounce like this. So you should try to learn because uh, then they can understand you. Uh. Okay. If you say McDonald's, they may not understand. They call McDonald's. Okay, I think my class also remember. McDonald's. Okay, why like that? They invent, they invented this. Huh? Okay, probably the first McDonald's opened in Japan. Huh? They name it like that. Huh? Okay, McDonald's. Again, why is it like that? Because the hiragana chart don't have L alone, don't have D alone. They only got other you, you know, lali do lo. Yeah, they only have all these to choose from. Hence, their English sounds like that, okay? Yeah, all these are additional info. Lah. It's not tested or anything, but it's quite interesting. Okay, once you get the skill of this, uh, you can sound like them. Lah. Okay, got a lot of words all use this kind, right? Like, uh, Kurejito Kado, Sutoberi. Yeah, it, it's all from the characters that you see in the Hiragana table or Katakana table. Okay, all these you can go and read on your own in page 37 page. Okay, additional info to learn. Lah. Yeah, anything I'm sure you can ask me next lesson. Okay, probably last part. Uh, the Nan Ban, I think we went through already. So, ne. Okay, what is this ne over here? Kore wa kaisha no jusho desu ne. Okay, the ne. Uh, some, some people talk uh, at the end of the sentence got yo. Okay, some got the ne, the back. Uh. Okay, the difference is just feeling. Uh. It's a bit like sing singlish. Uh. We cannot explain how to other people, foreigners, why it's la le lo. Uh. Okay, give an example. Sushi wa oishi desu. Means what? Okay, this one actually I haven't teach you yet, but I'm sure you already know. Okay, sushi is delicious, right? Okay. Then what if I change my sentence? Sushi wa oishi desu ne. What's the difference? It's delicious, isn't it? Yeah, something like that. Okay, you can say uh delicious. I don't know. Sushi is delicious, isn't it? Something. Yeah, something like that, lah. Okay, the translation can the. English, they try their best, uh, isn't it right? It's delicious, right? You know, that kind of translation. Just like we say, uh, 很好吃嘞, you know, that kind of, we got a le, uh, 
yeah, we have to see the feeling lah. You can you can tell from the intonation all this. Okay, to me ah, uh, nay uh, it's like you type SMS right. You behind any for like that. Okay, if you say yo ah, uh, it's more like exclamation mark lah. Okay, similar to your your Singlish lah lelo. Oh shit, that's nay. Oh shit, that's yo. Okay, the oh shit, that's yo becomes like uh, it's delicious. I tell you something like that. Or oh, exclamation mark. It's delicious. Okay, 很好吃嘞。You know that kind of. Can I explain one? Lah? Okay, you all, you all hear a few more times. Ah, you all can understand. Watch more anime, lah. It will help also. Okay, homework. Please watch anime before the next lesson. Okay, let me go to the next slide. Already. Okay, finally lesson three vocabulary. Okay, some of you may have done this lesson before, but okay, it's another very simple lesson. Okay, lesson one we did um lesson one we did about people, correct? Uh, watashi, anata, kare, kanojo, uh, Nihonjin, Singaporean people. Lesson two we learn about. Objects, right? Okay, let me test you your objects before I go lesson three. Uh, how to say you can just answer in your mind or type out also can. Okay, how to say magazine? Okay, three seconds, five seconds. Okay, very good. Somebody type already. I guess it's correct. Okay, so I don't need to check out. Okay, how to say newspaper? Okay, very good. Okay, you help each other. Uh, or say something or type something. Very good. How do you say table? Okay, uh, yeah, it's a good, yeah, very good, some even. Uh, how do you say chair? Okay, is how do you say people, person? Okay, hito, very good. How do you say cat? Okay, I hope most know, uh, neko is in our vocabulary. Okay, so all these are the common objects that we expect you all to already remember or memorize already. Okay, the more you know, the better. Okay, you know more than half, really very good. Okay, how do you say pencil? And... And pizza. Okay, very good. And pizza. Okay, last one, last one. How do you say dictionary? Jisho, very good. Okay, Jisho. So we have a lot more la, like katakana vocabulary. That one we not we won't be tested. We, it's not tested. Okay, but it's not difficult to know, right? The camera will be camera. Okay, camera. Very good. Radio. La jo. Okay, la jo. Something like that. Okay, because it's katakana, so it's not tested. Katakana is for elementary two. Okay, but uh, if you can hear using listening, I think everyone can understand. Okay, very good. Okay, let's go on to lesson three vocabulary. Okay, lesson two we learn about common objects. Lesson three we learn about places. Okay, so what lesson two things? Lesson three places. Huh? Okay, let me read to you all this uh, vocabulary. Although you all might have read already. Okay, koko, soko, asoko. So it's actually follow the KSA order, like what we did for objects, right? Objects we say this one is kore, that one is sore. That one over there, further away, is are. Okay, for places we say koko here, soko there, asoko over there, further away. Okay, so think about it's not koko soko ako. Uh, it's not ako. It's supposed to be asoko. Okay, a bit different uh, here. Yeah, just think about. Okay, right? Kochira, sochira, achira, uh, kochi, sochi, achi. They are all the same. Okay, this tree is for direction. That's why I got this place slash this way. Okay, this one is for here, huh? here, there, and over there, lah. Uh. Okay, kochi sochi achi is the same as the this tree. It's just informal. This way, that way, that way. Okay, so Chinese will be koko will be here. Uh, will be like zhe li. Okay, zhe li ah, plus minus. Uh. Then kochi will be zhe bian ah, uh, or 这个方向, uh, something like that uh, Okay. Yeah, anyhow, right? Okay, but can okay. So places. Let's learn some places together. Let's read together. It's only on the right? All right. First one. Uh, kyo shizu. Okay, so Kyoshitsu is the place you go, you come to attend lessons. Lah, okay, except now everyone is at home. Okay, Ote Arai toilet, Ote Arai, and toilet. Okay, both means toilet. Which one do you think is more frequently used? Toilet. Toilet. Hi. Okay, actually, toilet is more often or uh, more often used. Uh. Okay, and Ote Arai uh, is the same thing. Lah, but usually you will go to Japan, right? You will sure see this sign. One. Do you see this sign? Airport. Airport. Uh, airport uh, that one definitely have. <laughs> okay, yes. Okay, you will see this sign. And of course, they will help you. They will put English toilet or something below, right? Yeah, usually have this. But you go to isolated places, like my dad's hometown in the mountains. They put kanji in it. There's no. Yeah, but I think you all can recognize. Okay, if you cannot recognize the kanji toilet, okay, definitely work. all toilets should have this one, this kanji, sosi, which is toilet. Or they just put katakana toilet, also have, I've seen before. Okay, if you still cannot recognize, I'm sure you see all this, right? Okay, I think this one you all can. Yeah, I'm sure. You know it's a toilet or something like that. Okay. All right. Uh yeah. Ote arai actually just means uh washroom and toilet difference. Like Chinese right, like, uh, you can both are 
interchangeable. Okay, interchangeable. Okay, next page of the vocab. I think it's the same page of your textbook one. Okay, uh, okay, uh, reception desk, information counter. Okay, basically, uh, yeah, if shopping center, we call it information counter. Uh, okay, it's okay. Yeah, if you want GST refund, you can go there, the kind of places. Okay, if not, usually just a re reception. Okay, like tuition center, reception, the desk with the counter and the telephone. Okay, Jimu show office. Okay, office are uh, this kanji you probably see before, uh, show so drama always got on. Okay, Yubin Kyoku, Yubin Kyoku post office. Okay, it looks like a very long word, but it's quite useful. Anyone go to post office in Japan? Anyone? Yubin Kyoku? No? Somebody, uh, I mean, my mom go there to buy stamps. I uh, don't collect stamps, you can go there to buy. If not, you can send mail back, right? But why? Oh, why why go post office? Uh? Uh, okay, if you want to send back, okay, I, I the, personally I went to post office before. Okay, uh, but I send back some cream uh, because I take budget, uh, so I cannot bring back on a luggage or something. Yeah, I have no luggage, I cannot check in. So I send back some things I buy for friends. And uh, it costs the delivery costs more than the cream itself. Uh, so yeah. Okay, if you need to send back some stuff like some things too big. Or weird shape one you have to send back by mail by mail okay because sometimes you cannot bring onto the plane yeah so try to avoid post office yeah i mean okay but if you need to send okay the 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 thing that you drop your what's that called the letters right or your postcard right it's called post post -to. post -to. i think so post -to. that means that's the box only yeah no no you just drop inside the letter box only yeah that one is called post -to. okay you don't need to go to post office where you got uh, people inside like just the post -to will do Okay, next, here, here is room, nothing to say. Apato, apartment. Here, apartment, it sounds like, looks like Singapore, HDB, that kind of apartment. Okay, you watch anime, right? Typical Japanese apartment, uh, those second floor one, you know, that kind got the landlord downstairs one. Usually those uh, university students, they rent one room apartment. Yeah, that kind, uh, okay? I don't know if you can visualize on uh, those who watch shows or anime. Okay, otherwise, uh, some apartment can have two, three rooms. It's the same thing. Okay, if apato is apartment, right? What is depato? Depart, yeah, department. Okay, depart is department store, departmental store, or shopping malls, right? So all your uh, Takashimaya, uh, Orchard Ion, all these are all depart, shopping mall, basically. Okay, you go to Japan, sure go depart, right? Yeah, that, that's another vocab, lah. You can think of that. Okay, Genkan is entrance. Uh, if it's your room, is your is your house, is your front door. If it's a shopping mall, is the main entrance. Okay, basically, tamen, lah. Okay, Bichutsukan is art museum. Okay, Bichutsu, this word is. Bichutsu is just fine arts, ah, mm -hmm. okay, this one be high level work, mm -hmm. but anyway, it's just fine arts, okay? Right, uh, there's another jutsu, ah, itself is a quite interesting word, ah. you all know what jujitsu, right, all this, okay, it's just something, something arts, ah. you all know what ninjutsu? Anyone know ninjutsu? Okay, ninjutsu is your renshu, ah, your arts, ninja arts, ah. okay, we got a lot of arts in Japan, ah. Ju, jujitsu, judo, Basically, ro rosu. Uh. Okay, anyway, uh, okay, forgive me. That one is out of knowledge, out of syllabus, don't care. Okay, Eki station, kanji is N5. Okay, remember, I always identify the N5 kanji means must know. Have you all seen this kanji before in Japan? Those who've been to Japan before? So, yeah. Def definitely right. Okay, you go up, yeah, typically when sta station is usually train station, right? When you go up, you look up, oh, Tokyo Eki, Tokyo Station, right? Akihabara Eki, yeah, Osaka Eki, uh, yeah, all these stations are all station, okay? Why is there a horse there? Why is there a ma zi pang there? It used to be a horse station. Yes, you're right, okay? In the past, uh, uh, all stations all stopped horses only, uh, there were no trains like, in the past. Just like our Singapore downstairs is called Malu, right? Although there's no ma, I think. Okay, so it's all got to do with history. La. Anyway, okay, bus te, bus te, bus stop. Okay, uh, bus is a katakana word, te is a Japanese word la, or, or Chinese word, la, ting. Okay, because bus is foreign invention, hence katakana. Okay, bus, bus topu, I think they can understand, la, but but double meaning, bus topu can mean ask the bus to stop. Okay, kokuritsu toshokan, uh, toshokan is library, kokuritsu, this kanji is N5, if you, want, if you want to take note, kokuritsu. Hey, Kowali, uh. Koku, we see before. No? Chiugoku, Kangoku, it's the same word. Uh. Okay, and uh, yeah, Kokuritsu, uh, national. So, you Kokuritsu something means national something. Uh. Okay, Kokuritsu Toshokan, national library. Kokuritsu Hakubutsukan, national museum. Hakubutsukan is Bouguan museum. Okay, all these high level word, but you want, 
Anyone go to museum in Japan? Okay, first of all, anyone go to museum, go to library in Japan? Okay, uh, don't bother uh, because I go, I also struggle. Uh. Okay, anyone, because all the books in Japan, it's all Japanese. Uh. Okay, don't waste time there. But museum, I'm sure some people went to museum before, right? I heard my students say what, uh, stationery, uh, wenji, uh. Okay, bungu, bungu, uh, sorry, yeah, uh, I write here first, uh, bungu, wenji, stationery. Okay, bun, b u n g u, bungu, it means stationery, uh. Okay, that's just, uh, another high level vocabulary. Okay, uh, museum, right, ramen museum, all this, uh, I don't know what museum you ever go to. Okay, next, Singapore, do kokuritsu dai gaku. Okay, the, the, kokuritsu dai gaku, n5 kanji. Okay, please take note, because gaku, we see before gaku se, right? Okay, so dai gaku se means what? University student. Correct, university student. Okay, so Ta Xian Sun, we also got a uh, Koko Se, uh, high school, or this, uh, their system is different. They three years secondary, three years, no, three years middle school, three years high school. So we four years secondary, two years JC or poly. Uh, okay, anyway, that one is, uh, okay, all these are already Singapore context already. Huh? So, uh, Singapore KA Dai Gaku. Okay, KA is uh, management or, yeah, those don't really need to know. Lah. Nanyang Liko Dai Gaku. Okay. Uh, okay, don't need to know. Okay, more important is the Japan places are Dobutsu and uh, Zoo and Shokubutsu. And, okay, I'm sure a lot of people hear before the word Shokubutsu, right? Where do you hear the word Shokubutsu before? It's the brand. Yes, it's the brand. Uh. Shower brand. Yes. Correct, okay, everyone know this very well. Uh. And why, uh, if you look at the soap, uh, I think you see there's plants there. Uh, and put zhu, uh, it's actually from this word. Uh, because the formula are all plants formula. Okay, yeah, it's the brand, uh, which actually means plant. Okay, so uh, English is the, the unique thing that they say uh, zhu, they have this word zhu, they call botanical garden. But Japanese and Chinese same. We say animal park, plant park. Hence, dong wu yuan, zhu wu yuan. Okay, so literally it's animal park. So do bu is animal. Okay, dobutsu is animal. Shukubutsu is plants. Okay, what is N? N is actually park. It's like yuan. Gong yuan the yuan. Okay, yeah. Usually just memorize. Okay, I, I was thinking, hey, nobody goes to zoo in Japan, right? Then I think actually I also, I've been there. La. I think the what, what, Osaka, huh? Osaka, I forget. Tenoji is it? Or something like that. It doesn't matter. Yeah, okay. So go, yeah. So zoo will be important if you go to zoo. Botanical garden, I don't remember going. Okay, but most important thing is Kuko. Huh? What is Kuko? Okay, some people tell me Sky Harbor or something like that. Okay, Konggang. It's actually airport la, because that's the first place you reach in Japan, right? When you reach Japan, right? Okay, Kuko. Yeah, so they got, uh, I think usually it's what? Narita Kuko, eh, Haneda Kuko, right? I'm sure you see the kanji, la, but you probably don't care also. Right? Something like that, right? But they also got right for you at the side, la, Kuko. Yeah, it just means airport. Okay. Tourist hotspot should have English one, so you don't have issue of the kanji. Okay, Uchi is house, Kaisha company. Denki, electric city, you know Denki? If we say EF, uh, is oh, it home? Okay, acceptable. Okay, EF uh, actually more to house. Uh. Uchi more to home. Uh. Oh, okay. Uh, interchangeable, interchangeable. Kanji is the same also. Both means home or house. Yeah. Okay, very uh, good question. Okay, Denki. Anyone heard Denki before? Singapore got Denki. No? Yeah, okay, best denki. Uh. Oh, Japan is very cold. Yeah, I miss Japan also. Okay, <laughs> shampoo. Oh, shampoo, sham, shampoo, uh, soap. Hey, how come we all talking about shampoo and soap? Did I miss something? Because okay. shampoo. <laughs> oh, 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 okay, okay, yeah, yeah, correct, okay. But anyway, if you want to know what shampoo or soap are, uh, katakana, you can just google shampoo, uh, soap. Okay, you, you all go on sand, right? They always come with this three one, right? Correct me wrong. Maybe the male side, I don't know. Okay, but you know, they always have this three, like, soap for body, shampoo for head, and then got condition also. Condition, uh, yeah, all katakana. Okay, yeah, sorry, they were at the shokubutsu. <laughs> okay, yeah, denki, from best denki, right? Okay, we say best to denki. Best to denki, okay? I didn't know until my dad told me, uh, the, the, in Japan, it's not called best denki, it's called Yamada denki. The founder, I think, Yamada denki. That's the original name, uh, okay, of the electric. So you realize, right, you know how Japanese brands all use simple words are uh. actually it's true right you know ichiban is number one denki is denki shokubutsu shokubutsu yeah actually it's very simple words only uh. okay once you know japanese uh, you know a lot of things in singapore already okay then what is phone okay we learned that ketai then what handphone kuruma is car okay something to take note uh. these five kanji right these five is n5 
Okay, repeat again. N5 means your first 100, you have to learn first. Huh? That means uh, primary one learn in, in Japan. Huh? Primary one Japanese kids learn this N5 first 100. Okay? I have the textbook. Huh? I mean, I bought in Japan. They really learn one whole year, they take to learn 100. For your case, huh, it's probably about one year or so. Okay, because you take a JLPT N5 after E1 and E2, and maybe half of I1. Yeah, and usually it's about one year. Huh? Okay, but for my class, Jurong three hours is probably a bit faster. Yeah, but plus minus, okay? So I always ask you to take note of the N5 kanji. Okay, even though it's optional, but I just keep telling you, better to know, better to know. Okay. Right, Tere Bi, oh, it's all here. Huh? I thought we learned before. Okay, anyway, question? Jidosha. Yeah, both are okay. Okay, good question. Okay, Jidosha huh? actually is more to automobile. If you see the picture I show you just now, uh, very small, uh, it's Zidong Che. Okay, it's actually Jidosha. Okay, auto automobile, this translates to automobile because of the Jido or Zidong, uh, auto. Okay, can include your van and truck and lorry. Uh. So Kuruma is more to the standard house family car. Yeah, those five seater one, standard, standard car. Uh. But actually both are interchangeable. Okay, Jido Osha and Kuruma both are okay. Oh, so many vocab. Okay, Rajo Deji Kame, no need to say, I think we, we read through them already. Okay, Deji Kame is actually short form for digital camera or short form for Deji Taru Camera. Okay, that I'm not really care. That's the strategy Kame will do. La. Okay. Kame can also mean so I don't know. I'm sure a lot of people know it. Right? Kame, anyone? Okay, Kame actually means tortoise. Uh. I will try to find, I have a cat with a kui zi one, but disappear. Okay, never mind. Okay. The Dragon Ball Kame, uh, anyway, not important. Uh. Okay, kutsu, shoes. Okay, shoes is kutsu. I know kutsu sounds like Kutsu, uh, it's not. Uh, okay, pants is called pants or zibon. Zibon, uh, pants. Uh. Yeah, again, this is all our syllabus, uh, but I just show you anyway if you want to know. Kutsu. Anything, just check your dictionary, jisho.org. Uh, I think I told my class before. Okay, pan is bread. Uh, it, your, I'm sure you heard before, meron pan, right? You know what's meron pan? What's inside? What's inside meron pan? <laughs> lots and lots of sugar. Yeah, okay, you're right. Uh. I always thought yeah, it was uh, melon inside, uh, but it's, it's sugar, uh, okay? I mean, there's other feelings, uh, but it's just the brand. It looks like melon, okay? That's yeah, quite nice also, especially fresh. Uh. Technically nothing, uh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> Got plain one. Okay, yeah, and yeah, Dragon Ball, correct. Okay, uh, yeah, then you all know what's Ampan? Yes, What's red Ampan? Bean. Yeah, Red Bean, uh. you know Ampan Man, right? Am Ampan Man. I think maybe my time on, but anyway, yeah, do the, the, the cartoon. Okay, technically nothing. Okay, so all the pun is something, something bread. La. Okay, uh, next, kuramono is fruits. Uh, fruit, fru, furutsu also can. Uh, furutsu. Okay, if you want to buy fruits, furutsu, don't know, forget kuramono, say furutsu. La. You know English is a skill in Japan already, okay? But kuramono is a correct word for fruits. Okay, Shinbu newspaper, we saw it before. Saifu is wallet. Okay, Saifu, kanji is this. Uh, okay, it's not N5, uh, don't worry. I'm just going to explain only. Okay, those who can recognize kanji is just a cloth that wrap your wealth, correct? They yong the pu bao zu ni de cai or something like that. Okay, sai fu uh, is called sai fu. Wallet, purse, coin pouch doesn't matter, all sai fu. Because in the past, can I ask anyone here rented kimono before? Yes. Anyone? Yes? Did they give you a sai fu? No. You know, it's actually the drawstring back, a uh, sack uh, actually, with the two string only. Yeah, that is the sai fu. Uh. In the past, everyone used that one. Okay, the wallet, la, all this comes later when the Westerner invented. La. Okay, yeah, so those who rented kimono, right? Uh, yeah, ladies' rent is quite quite worth it. La. The guy's rent is not worth it. One, okay, I, I wear kimono, feel like like feel like a slave. La, I don't know, <laughs> yeah, like I just wear three shirts on top only. Yeah, you know, ladies' one more worth it, but I think the price about the same. La. Okay, but to take family photo, so no choice. Yeah, I guess never mind, just for the experience, it's fine. Actually, I took a few. La. Okay, Kyoto also took, uh, Fukuoka, my dad's hometown also took. Okay, anyway, uh, Kuni is country. Okay, Kuni is country. This kanji is N5, please take note. Okay, now you have seen already, this kanji, there are two readings, uh, Koku and Kuni. Okay, Kuni is the vocab on its own, uh, country. Koku is usually compound word. Okay, I think my class remember. That means there's something in front or behind, it becomes Koku. Just now we saw it, Koku Ritsu, Kuoli, uh, national. Okay, Koku Ritsu. Chu uh, Sorry. Uh, uh, when do you know when to use the kun yomi and the on yomi? Oh, very good question. Yeah, the one uh, I, I did I didn't mention to my class before. Okay. Okay, the easy way, uh the easy way for me to say uh, is memorize. Uh. Okay. 
but secondly, right, okay, the thing the thing is uh, how do you know it's kunyomi or onyomi? Okay, if you have some Chinese knowledge, uh, you can tell. Okay, which one it sounds like Chinese? Okay, it's actually the one on top, which is the onyomi, original reading, Chinese reading. Uh. Okay, kunyomi is the Japanese reading. Uh. Okay, you need to know how to differentiate these two first and how usually it's memorized. Uh. Okay, but of course, if you know Chinese even better, you can tell also. Okay, a, a good example would be this one. What's the two reading? Anyone can tell me? Okay, just now I got C, right? Okay, this is only the simple kanji, three strokes only. Okay, one is Yama, one is San. Which one is the Chinese reading? Okay, those who know Chinese definitely know. Okay, there will be students who don't know the Chinese reading, which is fine. Huh? Okay, yeah, so how? Um, yeah, so the Kunyomi will be the vocabulary. Okay, yeah, again, that means in other words, memorize. Huh? Yeah, in other words, memorize. Yeah, I think there's no much shortcut. Huh? Yeah, so sorry. That's the no choice. <laughs> okay, but if you can tell, usually you know. Huh? Because we know the vocab, Yama is mountain. Okay. We can use sun alone, cannot. Can we use cocoa alone, cannot. Okay. Why? Because we never learned a vocab like this before. That, that's one. So through experience and through memorizing, we roughly know which is to which to use. Okay. Example, what sun do you know? Uh, Fuji sun. Okay. Mount Fuji is called Fuji sun. We don't say Fujiyama. Although their places are places very tricky. Uh, they, they can use either. Yeah, that's very tricky. But that one is for places or surnames. Other than that, usually vocabulary by itself is Yama. Okay, just like another one, last one, last one. Okay, how to read this one? Most should know this kanji. Uh. This is two strokes only. Can you tell me the readings? Anyone? Hito and. Yeah, very good. Hito and. Jin. Jin, very good. When to use which one? When to use which one? Okay, very easy. I give you context. Uh. I just put like this. How to read this? Nihon Jin. Nihon Jin. We don't say Nihon Hito. How come? Maybe partly because we learned before. Yeah, okay. So Hito will be the Kunyomi. The Japanese reading by itself it means people. Okay, Jin by itself no meaning. That kind of thing. Okay, that is really quite difficult to yeah through experience. Okay, okay hope that helps out. But the one will be yeah. Don't worry, we will learn more vocab as time goes by. So don't worry. Okay, yeah, can be Nin also. Some some situation we use Nin counting people. San Nin, Yo Nin, three person, four people. Yeah, we use Nin. Okay, got other reading also. Okay, yeah, I finished the vocabulary here. Shigoto is your job. Namai is name. Okay, Namai means here. Nah. Okay, think of this also. Nah. Namai is N5. Yeah, you will see this in some of your homework nah, worksheets. They put kanji means here, dot dot means as you put your name. Nah, namai. Okay, have you watched the Kimi, Kimi no Nawa? Maybe yes. Nah. Okay, never watched Please Go Back and Watch. Yes, nah. Okay, I think it's the best movie. Nah. Please Go Back and Watch. Okay, she could die as homework. Okay, try to Google, find how to watch. Okay, Basho is place. Okay, America, America, Katakana, as you can tell. Okay, Indonesia, Doits. Okay, we country not tested. You want to find out more, please go and check dictionary. Okay, Doits, why they don't call it uh, Germany or something like that? Why Doits? Deutschland. Yeah, correct. Okay, I think the original reading of German is what I don't pronounce uh, Deutschland or Deutschland. They came from that word. Uh. Okay, came from that word. Uh. Okay, Burando brand. Hatachi, yes, Hatachi, like I mentioned. If you type in the dictionary, Hatachi, you get this. Okay. We don't say ni jusai. Uh, try to use hatachi as much as you can. Bango is number. Okay, we learned that already. Okay, doko is where. Dochira is where slash which way. Uh. This is more to direction as we saw just now. Okay, actually, in fact, we got a whole table somewhere later that summarizes everything. This table in your textbook. Okay, so I, I won't tell you much more now. Uh. Dore is which one? Okay, why which one? Uh? Because kore, sore, are there. Still remember this? Okay, this one, that one, and which one? You see all the question would all have a do in front of it. Right, all have the D. Okay, so K K S A is this one, that one, that one, and which one? So Koko Soko is here, there, where? Okay, I'll tell you more later like, in the table. Okay, Dochi, all these don't care. All these are question word only. Dochi, do no, do no. Okay. Oikutsu, Nansai, same. Onanji this. Okay, these two are saying how old are you? Nanban, what number? Okay, what number? Ikura, how much? We also did that before. How much does this cost? Okay, particular to is to join two things. Okay, we'll tell you more later. So she is to join two sentences. Huh? Okay, what I mean by two things? Uh, a to B means A and B. Okay. Dingo to mikan. Apple and orange. The to is to join two nouns. Huh? It's our N. Okay, so is to join two long sentences. Dodo, we mentioned USD, katakana. Okay, size H, ban is number. Okay, we know that already. Okay, this behind usually got numbers. Huh? Sun side, sun ban. Okay, three years old, number three. So numericals, we did quite well already for previous lessons. So don't worry, how to read numbers, you can read your textbook. Okay, if not, we are quite good with numbers already. 
Okay, so let's go to the start. Huh? The grammar in lesson three is very easy. Huh? More important is the vocabulary. Okay. Kyoshitsu wa koko desu. Okay, the classroom is koko. Koko is here. Huh? Zheli, huh? Okay, koko means here. Soko means there. Asoko means over there. Same issue. How come got two there? Okay, because asoko is further. They say about 10 meters. Okay, let me ask the class. How do you measure 10 meters? Okay, uh, nobody go measure one. Huh? So uh, it's plus minus. Huh? Okay, you say eight meters, you say asoko, also nobody fought you. Okay, we, we, are, we know what you're talking Which what, what you're referring to already. The toilet is over there. Okay, whether seven meters, 13 meters, we don't really mind. Uh, okay, although a rough gauge is 10 meters plus minus. Okay, all right, so examples, let me have everyone to take turns to read, shall we? Okay, let me have the go back to the start. Did I start from? Do you all know where did I stopped just now? If anyone know, let me know. If not, I go to the start again. So, Martin, can I ask if Question? um can you switch it around? Can you say Coco wa toilet this? Can. Can. Okay, you can. You are allowed to swap. That means uh, here is the toilet and the toilet is here. Yeah, you can. Okay, the order doesn't really matter. Okay, good question. It's the same as what we did, right? A wa B this. Okay, we just say B wa A this also can. A A is B, B is A. Can. Okay, you can swap the order. Okay, let me go to the start. Huh? So Elvin, Elvin, can you read number one? Oterai wa koko desu. Hmm, Oterai wa koko desu. Oterai is here. Number two, Brian? Ikutsuke wa soko desu. Hmm. Okay, okay, over there. Very good reception. Number three. Eki wa soko desu. Eki station is there. Very good. Number four, Koko. Koko san? Asu wa asoko desu. Hmm, asoko desu. Bus stop over there. Very good. Number five. Lila san, are you there? Yes. Yeah. Sorry, which one? Go one. Kokuritsu Toshokan wa asoko desu. Should I be over there? Okay, very good. Lokuban, let me go to the next person. Uh, Gabriel, Gabriel san. Jimusho wa doko desu ka? Okay, Jimusho, Doko Desu ka? Where's the Jimusho? Very good. Okay, uh, Glenn, Glenn san? Doko Desu. Okay, is it my problem or something? Okay, skip on, never mind. Okay, uh, Ian, can you try the next one? Yubin Kyoku wa Doko Desu ka? Doko Desu ka, very good. Irina san? Asoko desu. Asoko desu. Okay, do you know why they omit the subject? Because redundant, right? I see where's the post office? You just say over there. You don't need to say the, po the post office is over there, although it's, it's fine also. Okay, either way is fine. Okay, so how to ask where's the toilet? Let me ask the class. Okay, just want to mention it. Toire wa doko desu ka? Okay, very good. Toire wa. Okay, this is the place on the right. Toire wa doko desu ka? Okay, toire wa doko desu ka? Okay, uh, take note, we cannot swap the order for question word. That means just now when you swap, right? Can I say doko wa toire desu ka? Cannot. Question word cannot be at the front, okay? Cannot be at the front. Huh? But both are nouns, you can. You can swap A and B, but question cannot, okay? So let me ask the class. Um, yeah, with this sentence, you can ask, uh, if you go to Japan, maybe uh, daiso wa doko desu ka? Uniqlo wa doko desu ka? Okay, basically the place you want to go to. Okay, uh, okay let me teach you some shortcut. Huh? In Japan, we just say, we can even shorten it further. Toire doko. Yeah, okay, this is totally grammatically wrong, uh, huh? but we can, it's like Singlish uh, that it works perfectly. Okay. So you watch drama or anime, you should roughly can tell, right? Toire doko. Okay, so where's the toilet? Toilet where, uh, literally. Okay, do you know you can even shorten it? Toire? <laughs> I only know it in Japan. Uh, when my cousin's son, uh, okay, usually I call him by name, uh, Kenjana, okay. Can, uh, he just he when he was very young uh, now he already 16 17 already. I think the time he's eight years old. Uh, he just toy that can already. Okay, maybe you, you sound like a kid, uh, but it works also. Okay, toy that she go to the counter, toy that, but of course the counter person talk very nicely, uh, talk very formal. Uh, okay, right? So, so yeah, just stick to toy that wa doko desu ka, Okay, okay, uh, doko is where I think we know that already. Okay, next is the next tree, right? Kochira, sochira, achira, which is this way. Kochira is this way, sochira is that way. Okay, they can they say or here uh, which is the same as koko soko la. Okay, kochira koko soko sochira. Okay, so shacho no heya wa kochira desu. Shacho no heya means the boss room. 
is this way. Okay, what's the difference? Okay, they are more polite than Coco Soko Asoko. They are used when we cannot see the place or to show direction. Okay, and they are more polite to introduce people. This person, that person. Later, I show you the example. Okay, let me have the next person to read. Okay, I feel I cannot example more. Yeah, I feel it's quite long. Uh, yeah, so three hours. Uh, I think. Okay, so so far two hours. Okay. Okay, don't worry, you all can watch the replay. Where did I stop just now? I mean, I mean okay, Giselle, Giselle, can you read for me number one? Yeah. Torewa go kochira desu. Kochira desu, okay. Torewa kochira desu. The toilet is here, very good. Okay, number two, we have uh, Ginny. Ginny, Ginny. Gokuritsu hakubutsu sukan wa suchira desu. Okay, number three, we have Ginny. Gokuritsu hakubutsu sukan wa suchira desu. Mm, very good. Okay, Kokuritsu Hakubutsukan uh, National Museum. Uh, it's a very long word, uh, so, so don't worry about that. Okay, number three. Uh, Jaren, Jaren san. Dobutsu en wa Sochira desu. Mm, okay, Dobutsu en uh, Sochira is that way. Okay, it's uh, Number four. Uh, Jialing, Jialing san, you there? Jialing, Jialing, and uh, the, the, the Jocelyn not here, huh? Never mind. Joel, Joel san, let's go to Dongbak. Genkawa Achira des. Genkawa Achira des, very good. Okay, Johnny san, Goban. Okay, uh, sorry, number five, right? Okay, mm. uh, Shindaporu Kei Daikaku wa Achira des. Mm. Okay, so Kei Daikaku, uh, SMU is that way, very good. Okay, uh, Chief san? Uh, Kochi wa. Kochi wa wa Singapore no Tan. Sundays. Mm, very good. Okay, so why they say Kochira for introducing someone? Uh? Okay, in the past we use Konohito, right? This person is uh, over here. You see here, this person, uh, Konohito, this person. Because uh, Kochira is more polite. It's a bit like, why is Kochira in the first place? You all remember? Kochira is this way, right? This direction, right? Okay, so it's like, Chinese we say, this person, this direction here is, when you're pointing at a person, okay? So uh, instead of using konohito, you can, yeah, you should use konohito. Konohito is less polite. La. You don't want to say, 这个人是陈先生, 这个人是单身. Okay, and uh, okay, let's go to the next, number seven. Yeah, at least all the, yeah, Keith, Keith, your son. Bijusukan wa dochira desu ka? Okay, very good. Dochira desu ka, uh, KP san? Bijusukan wa sochira desu. Sochira desu, very good. Okay, Katie san. Okay, Katie san, are you there? Hey, Katie san, missing already. Okay, now Leah, Leah, can you try number eight Q? Yeah, I think we are almost done already. I think. Apato wa do chi desu ka? Okay, very good. Apato wa dochira desu ka? Okay, where is Apato? Okay, next. After Leah is who? Uh, Zivian is missing, right? I think. Marian? Marian? Huh? Achira desu. Mm, achira desu. Very good. Okay, so uh, again, you just keep repeating, right? Where is the place? Is here? Uh, is this direction? Which direction is here? Okay, basically, just keep repeating. Okay, you can actually, doko and dochira is about the same, to ask the direction. Okay, they say dochira is more polite. Mm. More polite, okay? Yeah, doko is fine also. Okay, so this is a summary of what we have learned since lesson lesson two and three combined. Huh? Yeah. Right, Korea is for thing. Korea wa ringo des. Okay, kono ringo wa. This apple is okay, but place will be koko wa. Uh, yeah, jurong des. Uh, coven des. Yeah, this is this place is coven. Okay, you all know lah. It's for place. Direction also can. Okay, kochira is a koko is a subset. That means kochira is bigger lah. Okay, kochira can replace koko wa. Yeah, and it's also nicer. So try to use this more. Kochi is informal, so try not to use this. Talk, talking with friends can. So you see, uh, pointer number two, Kochi, Sochi, Achi is less polite. Yeah, try not to use this. Yeah, by your friend, if you have a Japanese friend talk to you in this way, you can talk back in this way. La. Informal. Okay, then, yeah, that's just a whole table in your textbook. Okay, you see a pattern, la, right? You see K, S, A, then question word, Do, Di, ya. Okay, so like Do, de, which one? Do, ko, where? Do, chira, which direction? Okay. Yeah, so that, that's a summary of the whole table. Okay, so number three pointer, right? Tan san wa ote arai desu. Okay, what does it mean? Okay, does it mean uh, he is the toilet? Okay, maybe uh, because it's double meaning. Uh, but he said, uh, does not mean 
Tanaka is, a, is the washroom. Lah, okay? uh, logically, he's actually saying Tanaka is at the toilet. Okay? Why? Because of the format we learned just now, Tanaka Sanwa Asoko des. Okay? Uh, Tanaka is over there. And we simply change Asoko, this place, to another place only. Okay? Grammatically, it's correct. Lah. I know first at first sight, you, you may misunderstand. Okay? But we see more examples below. Then we are go through. Okay, next. Uh, Nicholas, can you try number one? Watashi no Uchiwa Tokyo desu. So again, this is the same thing. My house is here. Okay, it's not in the whole Tokyo, it's just somewhere in part of Tokyo. Okay, very good. Number two, uh, Nico. Kare no Kaisha wa Kanagawa desu. Okay, his company is at Kanagawa. Kanagawa, you know where is that? Okay, it's a prefecture below, below Tokyo. Huh? Okay, next. Pauline, can you try number three? Sensei wa. Kyo Chitsu desu. Kyo Chitsu very good. The teacher is in the classroom, okay? The teacher is, yeah. Okay, this has double meaning. What I mean by that, okay? It can mean that teacher's name is Kyo Chitsu. Uh, so, the first context we will know is not. Uh, okay, number four, uh, Kuroki san. Sing Singapore Kokuru Su Daigaku wa Ken Rich desu. Mm, very good. Okay, so it's just saying the university is this place, is here. Is can reach. Okay, number five, uh, Ying Xiang San. Hmm, I think your mic got problem, is it? Okay, okay, okay. okay. Here, the, uh, it's okay, I read for you. Uh, so. Hello, can you hear me? Yeah, can, can. Oh, now, now here, okay. okay. Nanyang, Nanyan, we could. Dai Kaku wa Zhuang Wei, Zhuang Wei's desk. Mm, okay, this this thing is at is at Zhuang Wei. But the Zhuang Wei is not pronounced. It's not <laughs> pronounced as Zhuang Wei. Right? We must Correct. read the Japanese style. Yeah, yeah. But the thing is, uh, yeah, it's the Japanese style. Westo or something like that. Zhuang Zhuang Westo. Yeah, something like that. Okay. Again, if you want to figure out how, uh, you see the hira, the alphabet they have. Uh, Zhuang. Where, okay, they have where uh, they are we also, uh, but this is in katakana la, in Itu, I'll tell you more. They got T la, Fa la, all this they have one, okay, but Hiragana don't have. You only got Ha, He, Fu, He, Ho, right? Yeah, I'll tell you more in the future la, about this, okay? And yeah, Nanyang Niko Dai Gaku, uh, just uh, MTU, la, MTU, okay, it's over there. Okay, uh, let me read for you the rest. Uh, so, Shokubutsu Yen wa, Klani Root Des, this Botanic Garden is here, Kuko wa, Changi Des, okay? So, Airport is Changi, so this one is quite straightforward. Okay, I think we wish until everyone will be very good. Okay, so if you ask someone, right, where, where are you working at? Right? Anata no Kaisha, your company, Doko Deska, where is your company? Okay, there are two meanings. Okay, maybe I can tell you more about this next lesson now. But usually, if you ask your friend, right, where are you working at? Okay, am I asking your company name or the location of your company? What do you all think? Okay, where do you work at? Inside Nani Tokong. Chinese, English all have double meaning, right? Okay, where do you work at? Uh, okay. I think yeah. the first question is where, 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 what is your company first, right? Hey, what uh, is the name of your company? Uh, you mean the question I asked uh, in English? Yeah. Uh, okay, I'm trying to tell you uh, that my question has two meanings. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so, so is the Japanese. Uh, English also, right? Chinese also. Really got two meanings. Really got two yeah, or was I Bishan Zokong? So it really depends on the context. Uh, okay. Uh, so what I'm trying to say is you see they have two possible answers. So literally it's your company, Anata no Kaisha, Doko, where? Where's your company? Okay. So can it can mean uh, where is your company located at or what is the name? Okay. Uh, yeah, any questions? Stimulation. Uh, but if let's say we want to ask the second question specifically, we we'll mm. say something like, "Anata wa anata no kaisha no tamae wa." Correct. Is it something like that, right? Uh, Correct. Yeah, it's actually over here. You are oh, right. sorry. I didn't. Yeah, yeah that, that won't good. have the, don't that won't have the first meaning. Yeah, you are right. You are right. Okay, so uh, there is a more specific way you can ask uh, which why you just say is correct. Okay, we want to say "anata no kaisha no tamae wa." Because your company's name is what? Yeah, that's the question what we want to say. What? None that's car. Yeah. Okay, they are more specific. That'll be the if you don't want to avoid confusion. Uh. Okay, confusion. 
Okay, and if you want to know the pers the company place, you can use this Anata no Kaisha no Basho. So Basho is place, uh, so your company's place is Doko Deska is where. Important is this one. Okay? Yeah, so this is the two ways of saying uh. Again, in real life, right, if I ask you where are you working at? If I want to know uh, which location, so I maybe can go meet you for dinner or something, then you tell me uh I work at 7 Eleven. Then how? I want to know where is the 7 Eleven, right? You just follow up a question, no? you just follow up this. Uh Dok, um, yeah, kaisha wa doko desu ka? Something like that. Okay, you ask the word, uh, kaisha no basho wa doko desu ka? Okay, same for English lah. You have to follow up a question. Okay, but easiest way of answering uh, is just saying, for example, I will say, uh, if you ask me this question, anata no kaisha wa doko desu ka? Where's your company, right? I just say, uh, bishan no seven desu. Bishan seven eleven. So I want short answer to two two questions already. Uh, I work at a 7 Eleven at Bishan or 7 Eleven from Bishan. Okay, then that, that's one option. Lah. But context usually, uh, if your friend asks you where you're working, usually it's the company name, I guess. Okay, really depends. Yeah, if your friend answer a wrong answer that you didn't expect, you can follow up a question. Okay, this one I'll tell you more again next lesson. Lah. Your homework also got this. So you can try try as homework. Lah. Just remember this paragraph in your textbook. Okay, I think too much content really. But okay, I'm going to finish soon. So uh, this is the same thing. Cocoa. Yubin Kyoku desu. Here is the post office. Okay. So when you're referring to place, right, we don't say kore wa. Uh, this is the post office. They don't allow. Okay. They prefer you should use here is the post office because it's a place. It's not a thing. Okay. So you have to use koko. Okay. Cannot use kore. Kore is for objects. Ah. Okay. Kore wa lingo desu. This is apple. Kore wa hon desu. This is a book. Okay. Right. They say not kore wa. You've been cooked as okay. You don't say here is the school Korewa Gakko desu cannot. Okay, textbook say cannot. I tell you, real life can. Okay, so yeah, I have seen people post or uh, they say something like that on Instagram or whatever. Okay, but perfect grammar they don't allow, right? That's just something to think not only. Okay, so if you have tests, uh, please use Coco la better. Yeah, conversational the rule all go here while you Okay, so just follow their rules first uh, for elementary. Asokowa. Ekides, okay, over there is a station. I know English that is a station, right? We try not to use uh arewa, that one, that thing is a station, okay, according to them, because it's a place. Same kochira wa sensei no here desu. Here this way is the teacher's room. Koko wa genkan desu ka is here the entrance. Okay, yes or no question, you just need to say yes or no. Okay, hi, repeat the whole thing, hi, genkan desu, or shortcut hi so desu. Everyone likes to do that. Okay, or ie. Ote arai desu. No is the toilet. Okay. No is the washroom. Right. So far, any question? Okay. It's really very simple. La. It's just a A or B desu again. Okay. A or B desu one lesson one. So Coco is here. Here, here is the classroom. Here is the post office. Right. It's just like that only. Okay. Any more? I think the five is the last one. Okay. Very good. Mm, yeah. Summary. Already. Okay. I will stop at five. Huh? Okay. Number five is nothing new. This is the last grammar already. Particle note we learned before. Okay, Chinese is just the very easy. Okay, however, English will be more to meet in or from. We learned that before, right? Okay, in this case, it's meet in or from. Okay, when do we use from? Okay, a good example, Singapore no Tan des. I'm Tan from Singapore. Mr. Tan from Singapore. Okay, but now it's from. You can be from also, but they say meet in. Doesn't matter. Both works. Okay, Kore wa Nihon no Kuruma. Okay, it's a Japanese car. Okay, it's a Japan car, it's a Japanese car, it's a car made in Japan, it's a car from Japan, all works also. Okay, so I just quickly go through examples. Uh, Americano Terebi, it's an America's TV. Okay, or TV made in America or from America, doesn't matter, both works. Okay, Chiyogoku no Radio, a radio from China. Okay, uh, China's radio or China, radio made in China, doesn't matter, all works also. Okay, remember our note, first meaning we learn is apostrophe, yes, right? It can work also. Okay, second one is what? You all remember? Okay, your about or on. Remember, a neko no hon des. Okay, a book about cats, right? The third one is this uh, from or made in. Yeah, how you know which one? Context. Okay, so no kuramono wa Malaysia no kuramono des. Is it a fruit made in Malaysia? Okay, I know made in very funny, right? We just say from. Or you can say it's a Malaysia's fruit. Malaysia's durian, you know, for example. Malaysia no durian. Yeah, Malaysia no ringo. Malaysia's apple. Okay, Singapore no saifu. Okay, this means uh, a wallet from Singapore. It can be made in again. Yeah, it can be from, can be made in, can be Singapore's Prosophia's wallet. Also makes some sense. 
can say, can we use Kara Made? Kara? Uh, Kara, the from can also. But uh, if you want to put, you can put here. Singapore Kara no. It's a wallet. Uh, from Singapore like the yeah. Uh, in fact, yeah, it's a bit higher grammar lah. That also can. Yeah, we also okay. have yeah. Okay, Tsukuri Mashta, another word for make in now. Uh, that one even better lah. But that one is in elementary two and above lah. Okay, yeah. So this is the simplest way of saying that. Yeah. So why you mentioned Kara can also. Okay. Otherwise, the uh, homework just stick to the particular note will do. It's the easiest way to answer. Okay. Okay. Let me go to the last part. Yeah. Let me see what's left. Uh. Okay. All this I'll let your let your read. It's all keep repeating. Uh. Yeah. Okay. Finish it. Very good. Okay. Just the first example number five. Kore wa doko no kutsu desu ka? Doko no. Okay. Because no we learn is from. Doko is where. Okay. Your shoes is from where or made in where. Okay. Because from or made in right. Okay, nari the shirts lah. So two meaning. It can be from this country, Indonesia no kutsu or New Balance no kutsu. Okay, it can be from this brand or from this country. So how? Okay, again double meaning ah, double meaning. So how? Okay, the solution I show you is in the here. Okay, you ask what what company ah? Do kono kaisha no ketai dewa. Which company handphone? Okay, or which brand? You want to know the brand instead, right? Do kono brando. Okay. Nali the price la, where the brand. Okay, this is the difference. Uh. Okay, if you want to be more specific, like just now we have this case, right? Where you work at. I want to know the place or I want to know the company you are working at. Okay, you can go read this whole paragraph. Uh. Alright, same for example six, seven, and eight. They're all the same. Where the doko no kuruma desu ka? This is a car, car from where? Can be from country, can be from a brand. Okay, where the watch? Again, country, from this country or from this brand. Okay, right? And where the camera, same thing like country and brand. Again, you have to be more specific. We can use either this for the company or brand. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Or country. Do kono kuni la. Yeah. They don't have the country. Huh? Okay, this is a brand. Okay, brand or country. Or the third one is the do kono kuni. Which country of the object that you want? Okay. Do kono kuni no bingo. Apple, for example. Which country's apple or nali the gojia the pink one? Okay, so sorry, Abi. Okay, in summary, right? These are the three meanings of particular note. Okay, here on about. Okay, this is one uh, we learned before last lesson, and from and made in, we just learned just now. Okay, in fact, but actually from we learned in lesson one, right? This person from this country and about or on. Yeah, about on is here. And where's the third one? Uh? It's not there. From me, ah, Professor Fias, ah, that one we know very easy, right? Watashi no anata no, your one, my one, okay? So let's look at this sentence, ah. Kore wa Nihon no hon desu. Okay, Nihon no hon desu. Ruben de shu, okay? Chinese also got two meaning, ah. It's a Japan book, okay? I use English, ah, because you use English, ah. It's a Japan book, okay? What does it mean? Japan's book, it can be a book about Japan, that means a book on Japan. Ruben de shu means you open a book, the book teach you about Japan's history, Japan's geography, all this, right? Or it can be just a English book made in Japan. Okay, double meaning. Okay, double meaning. So how do we know got two meanings, right? How? You should guess the meaning according to the situation. Now I tell you, I look at this sentence, I cannot tell unless I see the book itself. Okay. So the situation or the context or the actual book, you have to open up to know the actual answer. Okay. Same for Nihongo no Hon. Nihongo no Hon, Japanese language book. Okay, got two meaning. It can be about a book about Japanese language, which means uh we teach you about Japanese language history, their writing and all this, or it can be just a history, uh, it, can, it can be a chemistry book written in Japanese characters. Okay, you see what I mean? Okay, the third one is just to explain. Nihonjin no hon desu. Okay, it can be a book about Japanese people. Again, it could be their culture, their history, or it can be belongs to the Japanese guy standing over there. Because it can be a prosopheus also. Okay, so how do we know which meaning? Uh, you will have to guess when the time comes. Lah. Okay, so don't worry about that too much because particular note, Chinese is just the. Okay, you say just a drop and run the shoe, got two meaning ma. The books contents about Japanese people, or it can be that naka drop and run the shoe. Okay, can be that Japanese person's book. So we have to guess the meaning. Okay, yeah, all this is in your towards the end of lesson three text in your textbook. Huh? Okay, summary, we will go through this next lesson. Okay, it's actually you can go read it first. Okay, it's all about lesson one to lesson three stuff. Okay, who are you? What is your name? How are you? All this we did before. Okay, your country, your job. Okay, just go through number four. Anata no kuni wa doko desu ka? Means your country, anata no kuni, doko. Where is your country? Okay, we have many ways of asking where are you from. 
The most common one is Doko Kara Kimashitaka. That one is in lesson six. Uh, I'll tell you more on it in the future. Okay, you can go and read on your own to revise the whole thing. Okay, homework for you to try also. Right, same thing. This one all we just read. Right, the rest of the company. Okay, Anata no Ketai wa Nanban deska. What number is your phone number? We're going to read this. Okay, we read all this next lesson. Uh. Don't worry, I think that's too much for today. Okay, how much is something? We also did this before. Okay, but this part, right? Kono Shinbun to Han wa Ikura deska. How much is this newspaper and bread? Okay, you have two objects, right? You need to use two sentences. Okay, shinmun wa ichi doru desu. The newspaper is one dollar. And pan wa ni doru desu. Okay, so shite is your end to join sentences. Huh? Yeah, I'll touch on this again uh, next lesson. Huh? Then we're gonna ask each other for prizes already. Okay, so far any question? I think too much content. It's quite true. But actually, it's still, it's still okay. My, 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 my usual first three hours. Uh, but usually I try to end early also. Uh. Okay. If no questions, right? Uh, before we go to breakout room, let me see the one. Uh. Okay, y'all, let's go to the breakout room, shall we? Okay, got twenty people. Uh. Oh no, too many people. Already. I think we, we forget about the breakout room. Uh. Okay, I can tell you what y'all can do now. Okay, um, how? Uh, y'all want to go to breakout rooms? Okay, I tell you what, we try uh, because this time a lot of people. I open another two more rooms, so every room should have six to seven people. Okay. So everyone, please go to the link that you saw just now. There are two links, I think. Yeah, create another two more so everyone can go to their room already. Okay, in the words document, I think below are two links, right? I go create another two more. Okay. Okay, sorry, sorry. Before you go there, before you go there. Okay, later you will go there and seven of you, six to seven people. Okay, maybe five to six. I think some minus should be enough. Five to six, max seven. You are gonna give the next person a five-digit number. Then they will translate. Okay, practice among yourself. Go a few rounds. That means alphabetical order. Lah. Okay, first person, ask second person. Give them a number. Then they translate. Okay, correct or wrong, everyone else can correct each other because listening skills. Right, then done already. The second person, give a third person a number. Then go on a few rounds. Okay, my class have done it a few rounds. Lah, so they can they can take the lead. Lah. I think they all know what to do. Okay, then the last slide is asking each other how much is this, how much is that. Practice numbers again. Okay, so that's the last two parts you all do in the next 10 15 minutes. Okay, all right, you all can join the two rooms already. We're gonna create more rooms. Yeah, then I'm gonna mute the main room right there. It's not very noisy. All right, please join the two rooms right now.